born for queen, born for don't star, yeah, my born for rich, make my own videos from rocks to rich, but comments are critics, so she don't have a weird funny born for kid, never said no time, me hard for switch, no, no, come easy, me hard for trick, but born for this, it's a cool, we remember, but we are come from, hard life, yes, don't in a the dungeon, no, see, we friend them, yeah, cause we gone, man, so far, we are not that we are run from, how to make it in a life, and that we say, Mama, I was the best ever, no, then, no, that she went on a hot street from Monday to Saturday. A fun Sunday, me, I just want to get out of this. We can keep us busy, so we are the quick. Bounty don't start, and we bounty rich. Make my own videos from rock to rich. But comments are critics. So we don't want to wait for the party kick. Never say no, call me a trick. No, 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 The man upstairs that by me side all the way is a man of his words. Every time me disappoint him, never leave I be straight. The mount a mistake me make. The blood of Yeshua was missing right away. And if it wasn't for you, but have you paid the price of wage and it is quite a price to pay. So when your hands my all are late, for in your eye trust and the love is constant like a lake. Lord, I need a push to move for you and I volunteer, and I'm just a snowflake. I want to see the promised land, so as I'm blowing down, and catch me and I'm just a dick. Now leave me alone for fears this third cause in season time, I'm certain to dissipate. Carry me along, yeah, I cannot promise to be perfect, never let the feet strong, yeah. And I just call upon your name, and without a second doubt, me no say I go answer. So why you go and hold it bait, while I praise you for being there, every millisecond within a lifetime. The man upstairs that by me side all the way is a man of his words. Every time me disappoint him, never leave I feel straight, eh. The mount a mistake me make. The blood of Yeshua was missing right away. And if it wasn't for you, but I have to pay the price of wage, and it is quite a price to. Yeah. Oh, why you can't suffer? You know I don't deserve it, but then all it I suffer. All the wrong doings, strict doings, spirit weak doings, all when me slack for me good doings. Yet I have me loose ends, yeah. Yeah. You curve the winds of my storm. The reason me not give up on my distance of my strong. The back up with the moments when me not pay me left on. In times of despair, yeah, that they all the days down. Oh, yeah, remain by my side. In order for me make it over, all you need to guide. Just go and steady blessings while your commands are your abide. I cannot do it if you're not direct life. Yeah, believe and you must receive. Live by the motor when you kneel on your knees. Remember all you do for you when the devil try to deceive. <laughs> Battery, right? You must receive the interest. Your cool fears. Them can't do we on the like shoes, please. Me not like friend with two fears. Man, born for this. Never keep up easy, so me hard to quit. Born for don't start, yeah, my born for rich. Make my own good years from rocks to rich. Bad comments are critics. So she don't wanna wait for the born for king. Never sell out, got me hard to switch. No, no, come easy, me hard to trick. But born for this, I'm true. So far, we shall attract me in seal. And deep inside it, I bring fear. Can't buy sugar, so me have to ring here. Bigger heads. I'm tired of the ring game, but you know about hard life. Cool, no about pain and pressure. He not the get up, we want we like better. Yet still love you, they are tearing nah, all like a law. Now nah, nah, yes, I like full of fun. Fatty little and I go no bad dog. No spread food coming up down. I be on top of your wet life on a floor. Yes, still man, I lose fear. My time, people. 
circle small you understand they stay out of trouble that way anybody can call your name that you say she say he say anybody say gossip you know we're eliminating that when we keep our circle small and not only that not everybody is always with us you know they smile with us but their heart is saying something else good night all my lovely people my darling my realist what's going on i know it's christmas day many people who are celebrating getting together with family and friends and all of that you know, but tonight, you know, it's a night we're also going to go down memory lane. Going to have some Christmas fun. Don't forget, make sure that you have guests in the pan. You don't want the guests to finish, you know, because guests always finish on Chris on holidays or Sundays. So we're going to talk about a lot of things. We're going down memory lane tonight. So we just want to um, wait for others to join while we we'll play some music in the meantime. Yeah, it's holiday. Everybody's home. Most people are home. School is out and all of that. Hip, hip, hooray! Hip, hip, hooray! It's Saturday night. It's Saturday night live with your Royal Cleopatra chatbot. And that must say, what you say? Adjust reality TV. Adjust reality from Cleopatra Mine. Cleopatra, she there. See all the boys and girls and we need a teacher. Number one sensible specialist in the area. She not follow, follow, cause she done a leader. So you better come true for your best behavior. Behavior, behavior. She gonna make sure she not late for reach us. So what are they? I just reality. But Cleopatra, mine. Yeah, we're gonna pull up for the new chill spot. That's the same. With your number one sense of a specialist. Shark boat, and that's the same. What you say? Meet her up there. Live with Royal Cleopatra. She'll chop out a whole of things. Yeah, health, wealth, lifestyle. Yeah, man. She'll go put in a little sense of you, my night, and talk about the Almighty God. Meet her up there. Royal Cleopatra, Saturday Night Live. Ha. Ah. Jean, June, and Sharon, them say that them love you. That's what they say, yeah. Saturday Night Live, Royal Cleopatra. Meet her up here. Yeah, roll up, pull up for the new chill spot, Saturday Night Live, with your number one sensible specialist, Shark Mouth, and that's his head. Hi, Edith, how are you? Welcome, Edith Jared, to Adjust Reality TV with Royal Cleopatra, a.k.a. your number one sensible specialist in the stratosphere, whose power from stupidity to sensibility. Thank you for joining tonight. Also, Charity, I see you. Yeah. What you say? Meet her up there. Live 
with Royal Cleopatra. She'll chop out a whole of things. Yeah, health, wealth, lifestyle. Yeah, man. She ever put in a little sense of humor in it and talk about the Almighty God. Meet her up here. Royal Cleopatra, Saturday Night Live. Ha. Ah. Jean, June, and Sharon, them say that them love you. That's what they say, yeah. Saturday Night Live, Royal Cleopatra. Meet her up here. That you say, come on, people. I know you're all eating, pulling, still pulling gifts. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What is even the true meaning of Christmas with all the Christmas tree and decorations and all of that? Do we even understand what's going on? We're in a time just like um what what just passed by a few months ago, like you know Halloween and all these things. What is the true meaning of this season? You don't even hear people talking about it, right? Mm -mm. Isn't it supposed to be about the birth of Jesus Christ? Even though I don't even know when is the actual day date that he was born. But I know for sure he was born of Mary, his mother, you know, in Bethlehem in a, in, in a little inn. In, you know, simplicity. You know, you ever think about the way how Jesus Christ was born? Some of us, we get up and we kill up ourselves every day. We want this and we want that and the most expensive this and the biggest house and all of these things. But have you ever really stopped and thought about how simple the example that Jesus Christ set for us, the way how he was born? Very simple. So what does that tell us? Hmm? What does that tell us? Simplicity we use to survive, right? Simplicity we use to survive. Yeah. Right. I'm talking daily. It's on my mind. This is just crazy. I I've been feeling passionate lately. Just that. loving music as much as I love ladies. Oh, any artist them not cease for motivate me. Please my sister write music where elevate me. Let's work as one and encourage each other daily. Mm. Ah. Love the current speech and I take them down to melodic words of inspiration where I feel the youth to prosper. You can never feel things aren't working out. Be certain to the ego and assure that. Just in the faith till I start to hold back. Till I start to tell yourself that this is where the world stops. stops. NASA, just let the plastic max not be so NASA. Would that tell you no difference? Go within and rise, you got to the surface and realize, man, I create and this I just see better days. Me now go stop, please trust till me start to better days. Lately, just that. Loving music as much as I love ladies. Oh, any artist them not cease for motivate me. Please press this for right music where elevate me. Let's work as one and encourage each other daily. Mm. Ah, music and me get away. Love the use it, express me step when me feel away. Me have me feel this when me go to when no one for when me need Me need to do life out to all it be sad. Life never always sweet like a desert. Nevertheless, me grateful so me make it this far sincerely. Life could have never turned Good fortune's been leading passionate lately Just that uh, Loving music as much as I love ladies Ooh Any artist them not cease to motivate me Please press this to write music where elevate me Let's work as one and encourage each other daily mm. Tonight, I'm also feasting. I'm having fish. I got chocolate. I got cake. We have yam bad cake over here, so mm, we're gonna test them out tonight. Here, we have about five of them. 
Yeah, about Auntie Dan and Yam Bad Cake. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Now we're family. Feeding my face too. Mm -hmm. I'm eating fish. I eat fish first before I get into the cake. Them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. Want your more music while I eat? Mm-hmm. Man called Jati, you know, upcoming artist. I'm talking daily. It's on my mind, this is just crazy. Nice, but girls, guess what? 
Oh, let me know done grow it because may I have eco. Mm? Saturday Night Live with your royal girl, Cleopatra, a.k.a. your number one sensible specialist, girl that eat fish, and I have eco. Oh, that girl. Mm? None of make no sense. So, you know, tonight is a night where everybody get together. Mm -hmm. And feast and all these things. Mm -hmm. And tonight, you know, it's tonight or what? The last Saturday night in the year, in 2021. Mm -hmm. Last Saturday night in 2021. We'll look back at the year, year in review. Mm -hmm. Talk about the things um, that people normally do this time of the year. What is the true meaning of Christmas? Mm? Gonna eat fish. What's the true meaning of Christmas? I'm gonna have yam bad cake. Mm -hmm. Gonna eat fish and girl have dante done and yam bad cake for test tonight. Mm -hmm. We'll have Java. We have planting, we have coconut, we have the regular fruit cake, and I think sweet potato. Mm -hmm. Five of them. Mm -hmm. So, who ready for dine with me? I just want to say to the less fortunate, them, I hope that. For those of us who could have stretched our hands to others, who couldn't find a meal tonight, or any other night for a matter of fact, I hope that we were able to stretch our hands to others, you know, mm -hmm. to not let them feel left out, or not only to feel left out, but to make sure that they too can have a meal and not be hungry out there. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Tonight, topic, does size matters that we're going to talk about tonight. Later on, after we're done, do the testing of the cakes and to done a yam bag cake and the fish where I eat and all of that. Topic tonight is, does size matters? Put in a little or a good. Mm-hmm. All right, guys, there's some music, turn it down low. Hey, uh, I be in trance. Your cool fears. Them can't tell we out there like shoes, leaves. Me not like friend with two fears. Man, band for this, never give up easy, so me all be quick. Band for don't start, yeah, my band for rich. Remember, I'm up with years from rocks to rich. Bad comments are all critics. Some see the man and wait for the band for kick. Never sell out, got me hard to switch. No, 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 come easy, me hard to trick. My band for this, and true. So far, I tried to insane. And deep inside, it a bring fear. Can't buy sugar, so me a fear in gear. Bigger heads. I'm tired of the just have to give God thanks. But that's why I'm big up God all the time. But that's why I'm big up God all the time. Because if it wasn't for God, mm, I don't know where I would be. I don't know about you. Tonight, girl of food galore. Of chocolate, one of my clients gave this to me. It's so delicious. Russell's Stephen, excuse me. Russell Stover got this from one of my clients. I'm not gonna lie, this tastes so delicious. It says, Made from our hearts with tradition and passion. Anybody ever tried this brand before? Mm. 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 The man fish bone. When fish fried dry, it's supposed to you crack up. You're supposed to be able to crack up the bones. I'm not sure. 
Mm, I mess up myself. Making like a baby. <laughs> hey guys, Russell, one of my clients gave this to me. And I'm telling you, I enjoyed, I'm enjoying it. I eat up most of it already. But like I said before, we're getting to the show tonight. Happy hour right now. Mm -hmm. Giving thanks and praise to God. Enjoying food. Giving thanks for life. Guys, look here. The way order. Look at this. Read what's inside. It says, share chocolate, make happy. Every little moment of joy we share makes life sweeter. Isn't that so cool? Yeah, I got this as a gift from one of my clients. And look what I leave out of it. That's all I leave out there. So delicious, not gonna lie. God, big up. Can't stop big up God. Mm -mm. Yeah. So, we're gonna go down in our auntie now. Auntie, auntie Dan and Yam Bad Cake. Mm hmm. All who beg no get. And all who beg no more. Mm hmm. Mm hmm Hi, Lani. How are you? Mm hmm Nom, 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 nom. Food sweet is a fish. Meat in fish. With lime and... How can I something? And I'm going to be testing Auntie Donna's Nambad cake. So, can I show the people? <laughs> it is such a shame. Also, one of the cake we will pull already. This was the um kind of thing there. This was the get squish, but. Well, now I watch that. This was the um, Auntie Dan and Yamba cake. This are the um, sweet potato. And look what they found there. People, them deal with it wicked. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to lie. This, this tastes like, I thought this was a coconut when I first tested it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. When we are test cake, we're not pretty up anything. Yeah. Just a good one in it. And to that, I am bad cake. Mm -hmm. It's like a sweet potato, that's all they bought it. So I must say that it don't taste like a traditional sweet potato pudding because this is not pudding, it's sweet potato fruit cake. So it have a little rum. You can taste whatever fruits or whatever in a hit, you can taste it. Mm -hmm. But that's all leave out of it. And it's done on the cake. It's a sweet potato. Um, this is our sweet potato um, fruit cake, Auntie Dan and Yambad cake. But anyways, we're gonna move on from the fruit, from the sweet potato. Like I said, that's all I leave out there. Them look at all the pan. Them deal with it wicked. Hmm? It's almost done. And this is the planting. And the people them start on this too. I think about half of this leaf. When my son actually tastes this one, I must say, what kind is it? Me never tell him what it was. He said banana. So me tell him, say, it's not banana. It's planting. So Auntie Dana, me am bad cake. It's a planting. It's all right. I mean, as I say, for your taste, you did not say different. And they might be in the rum. So this is how I leave out there. So the people that might deal with the cake, they're wicked. Mm-hmm. Auntie Donna planting, planting, um, planting fruit cake. 
So, like I said, when my son tastes it, he say a banana. That was his reaction. But it's not banana. It is actually planting. So, while we're at feast for the food and I taste Auntie Donna and Nyambad cake them, make sure not get ready for the topic tonight. Those size matters. And, you know, how about Christmas look a bit so. So, this is what they are. Um, the planting. Planting. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we have only part until we're not going into the Java yet. I will have the coconut and we also have the regular fruit cake. Yeah, so much of them we have. Mm -hmm. Many people know the plant could have make fruit cake. Can you imagine? I'm going to say you can taste the planting. Mm -hmm. Can taste like the alcohol, whether wine or rum, whatever. Not too much. I know I'm like with them so far. I'm showing sure the sweet potato. The sweet potato are almost done. What I like about them, they're not that sweet. So for people who are diabetic and not supposed to eat a lot of sweetness, I can tell you, they're not overly sweet. Yeah. Sorry, when we really want to taste of the Java, but my can say January, Auntie Dana go on with her said because me never know it's a plant and could I really make fruit cake. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so my can say my taste the sweet potato already, and this are the plant. Mm? Hi guys, welcome. Thank you for joining tonight's topic. Is does size matters? So get ready. We talk about the things them eh, on. I just reality TV with Royal Cleopatra. But you know we have a feast a bit because a Christmas night tonight. We're still in a Christmas day in the garnet for where I am at. And for most of you, it's still Christmas day. That's what they say. And so we're feasting. May I eat fish? May I eat Auntie Dan and Yambad cake them? May I just have some of the sweet potato. May I just have this uh, um this uh plantain. I may also eat chocolate. When me done tonight, yeah, I got this from my client, guys. Yeah, Russell Stover. It's all that and a bag of chips. I'm not gonna lie. Tastes real good. I don't know if me that take my money and buy it, but I appreciate my client who gave me this. I'm gonna lie, the chocolate them taste really good, uptown style. All right, so I'm gonna put on the planting and we're gonna try one next one. All right, so this, as I say, one next one. I don't know where the traveling now, so them kind of squeeze up a little bit, but we're now watch that. As long as the cake's still in there, that's what matters, right? Mm -hmm. So this one here is the Nyambad fruit cake. So I guess this is the original. Let me say, them squish up a little bit, but that's okay. Now watch the face, yeah. So this are the um these are the nyambad anti dana nyambad fruit cake. Yeah, so we're gonna taste this one now and taste where it tastes that. So this are the original um let me say it's squish up a little bit. The the the, the container can you know I know the original thick um baking tin, so you don't know traveling with it and all, you get a little squeeze, yeah. Plain full, bag full, baggage answer, chop on one another answer. Mm -hmm. You know how that go. So we're going to go down and eat now. So we had sweet potato, we had planting, and now this are the fruit cake, the original Nyambad fruit cake. Yeah? Mm -hmm. this. And like I said, so far, they're not too sweet. Yeah. So we're gonna go down in this now. Auntie Dana Nyambad fruit cake. You see? Texture and all. Nice. Look nice. So we're gonna when you smell it, let me tell you what it smells like. It smells like them wedding cake. Just smelling it. And this is my reaction. My genuine and real and true. Just smelling it, it smells like wedding cake. Alright, so we're gonna taste and all. Mm-hmm. 
first of all, it's gummy. I'm gonna like that. What did I mess up before? Mm -hmm. All right, so far, what are the three when I taste so far? This are number one, and these are the original fruit cake. Mm -hmm. This gummy ball. Anybody have anything gummy like? Mm -hmm. No matter about gummy. Mm -hmm. Look, guys, look. See? Tastes like when the cake, it look like when the cake too. And it tastes good. And as I say, it's not too sweet. Trust me, I love that about it. And when I tell about it now, it not taste like it's short or nothing. You know, sometimes you get some fruit cake and it just tastes like something missing. So far, my honest reaction is everything right. The smell right, the taste right, the texture right. Yeah, that are my honest opinion. Mm -hmm. So this is number one for me so far. But as I tell you now, what I want for taste are the Java. Because me never know the ribbon, I could have make cake. Me never know the plant, I could have make cake. Mm -mm. Me know about plant and porridge, and me know about ribbon, and you drink. Me never know about making cake and fruit cake like that. Mm -hmm. So so far, this is good. Me not lie. This texture, gummy, it, it. Have gumption. I don't know my table for all who have gumption. Mm -hmm. All right, so we have um so this now are the coconut. So we have them galore. Anti Dan and Yambad cake which are Naples, Florida Ray. Oh, yeah. I wanted to feel like since I own alone could I have Nyambad cake and go to Jamaica and get cake and come show up from people. Me have cake too. What the honor? Mm-hmm. I have cake too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, you. Straight from yard. Mm -hmm. In a broad. Yeah. Nyam bad cake. Yeah, man, we have to support the thing. Mm -hmm. me couldn't, me, if I egg me a fin of the red. Mm hmm. So, I'm see. <laughs> so, you guys, so this now. See, she put like a coconut on the top so she can differentiate it. Because at first, when I did taste the sweet potato, I did think of the coconut. Mm hmm Can I even give my, my pasta a piece of it? I thought it was coconut, but this are the coconut. See there? Auntie Dana, them bad coconut fruit cake. So we're going to taste what this tastes like now, right? I saw no say food I share now. Now you're the place quiet. I know the craving people, them, them, no want nobody around them, no nice. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. So we're going to put them in and eat, you know. But this time I just going to get far, I'm not going to do like everybody call me craving, yeah? But anyway, it's just for TV purpose, broadcast purpose, I'm not going to go on like a pig, all right? I'm going to put like a decency to the thing, you understand? So this are the, um, as I said, this are the coconut. So hearing most people's reaction them always say the coconut so may i go test it for myself now so far the original fruit cake take it out of the three when we try this or the fourth one right mm -hmm. Let it be small. Mm -hmm. That one. Mm hmm. What's that? The texture. Again, then coconut could I make fruit cake and sit down a bad like that. Mm -hmm. It'll happen. That's like coconut. All right, so the last one will save the best for last Java. But before we go to the Java, girl, I drink ginseng also. I'll give free advertisement today. Mm -hmm. Can I get the opener, please? Can I get the opener, please? 
Yeah, guys. Hey, Sharon. Well, I'm not even asking the comment and because I'm just dug in a cake. So, how can you mail? Oh, the comment, they may not even see because something like, okay. How can you mail me a piece of it? I'm curious. Could I get a piece of each? Mrs. Oh, may I go do that now? Listen, I'm going to show you what I found the sweet potato. The sweet potato almost done, Sharon. Listen. But could I mail it because it now goes spoil because it have, um, them have wine and rum in them also. So you don't know. This is how I found a sweet potato. So I don't know. <laughs> At this left out of the sweet potato, okay. At first, I thought this was a coconut, but a sweet potato. But you can taste, I think you can taste in a, my opinion. I think you can taste a little bit of coconut in it, and it don't taste as I say, I'm not pudding, it's sweet potato fruit cake. So you're not gonna taste the original, the original, um, Yeah, you're not gonna um taste it like oh pudding would that taste. It's not pudding, a cake. All right, so that left. So I'm gonna know how I'm gonna send a piece of each in a Sharon. Gonna put it in one little box and, and send it um priority me and I make you get it in a two days. If I send it off Monday, you should get it by Wednesday. I'll try. For real, in a real life. So I'm gonna wash down all of that first. Hold on. It's tastes nice to see. Um have been ginseng it called ginseng up all right so java time now tonight's topic guys is does size matter so i get ready i don't know on my personal youtube channel we talk about the real things then so all of my real estate i'm gonna get up on the self get up on the thoughts i'm getting a voice ready to call in what's up and tell me what's your opinion does size matter for me we can tell on the right of the butt i think functionality is what matters to me yeah the function of the tool i think that's what matters for me understand yeah so here we are going now i'm gonna see the nice pretty purple my favorite color royalty you understand royal cleopatra like over here so mm -hmm. You see that? Mm-hmm. Royal. So this is the Java Antidana Nyamba the Java fruit cake. This is no lava. You understand? Look quite nice and clean and pretty. Wee -oy. All right. But you know it's a bad habit. Me love smell food, but you know. A fruit cake, them says that may I smell them for smell what smell you get off them. Like I said, a fruit cake, you can it smell like wedding cake. This you know have like a fruit cake scent. It um and Sharon, sorry if you smell the food, man. If you still want it, but that's something stay. <laughs> My nose all up in a heat. Listen, where is the knife? Hold on, where knife there? Where did the knife disappear to? So now I'm ready for eat the Java cake and the knife disappear. Anything could have gone so? That don't make no sense, right? Okay, hold on there, guys. All right. So Java time. Um, Let me clean off the knife. Hold on. So my half plastic. Again, let's clean it off. Put it. Yep. Tick, it tick, cutting it, it tick. Sorry. All right. See the texture, guys. Color, I love the color. Mm -hmm. So this was what I always wanted to taste from Auntie Dana, which is the Java fruit cake. See the color? Nice and pretty. The texture looks nice to me. It looks almost like the fruitcake texture. Yeah. Mmm. Now you can smell the Roma so in a head. Let's go. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Guys, mm-hmm. 
But now I lie. Angela is still on at this. Mm -hmm. This, but now I go lie. I'm a now bias, not because I hit me the really want taste. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm. Mm hmm. Wow. Besides, I'm never getting on that. It's sorry. But, guys, okay. So, the aftertaste, you get a little. You get a little taste, a little aftertaste. It's not too tangy, zingy. But I think because of the fruit, you get a little taste at the back. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's tight. Like vice grip. Mm -hmm. So the fruit get gummy. It's tight. But now it is not telling like guys. Mm -hmm. It's tastes good. Mm hmm Auntie Donna, this is one. Mm-hmm. So this, out of the five of them, when we try, this and the fruit cake, Thai. The Java and the fruit cake, yeah. And then I would say the sweet potato, and the and the coconut kind of tie and then the planting so that that those are the five that i happen to test and that's my feedback the fruit cake the original fruit cake and the java number them tie a one and the sweet potato and the coconut to me that's just me and then the planting but it's a go on, I'm not gonna lie. And as I said, a fruit cake, it's it's it, it comes like an original wedding cake. That's the texture it have and the scent and everything, everything. Yeah. So there you have it. Auntie bad, Auntie Dana, Niam bad cake them. Tastes really good, I'm not gonna lie. She got talent. And I saw when people have talent, we've put with talent to use. Yeah. As I think the whole of we have talent. Yeah. And even though your talent can be the same as baking to one or nothing, yeah, man, the more the merrier. So that's the review part. And to done on bad cake, them. So we could get to now eat, you know. So what go on, my people? What's going on, my really side, Judith? What go on? Belly of a boss. I just said me fish. Sorry, guys. We just said eat one big fish, chocolate, and how much cake? Let me see what I thought I sweet potato cake. Mm -mm. So, guys, what's going on? How was your day today? How's your sorry? How's your holiday going? Did you meet and greet with family and friends and even foes? What's up? What's going on? Hmm? What go on? What you not up to? What's going on? What's going on? Hmm? I know some people probably still feasting. Feasting. I full of them fierce. I know all tomorrow church I go full in our people. Mm-hmm. I thought like a bit about Christmas and so what are your norms? So Christmas time, you know, say certain time of the year, the time church full up, especially Christmas and Easter. Them time that people put on them church best and step out. So tomorrow, make sure say you reach a church early, cause you don't know a church will go overflow. Well, since the world has changed for the last two years, I don't even know what what I don't even know. Hmm? Is your Christmas still the same? 
since 2019 compared to now. 2019, 2020, 2021. Is Christmas time still the same? I think it has caused a lot of division, if you should ask me. A lot of division. Some people they east, some people they west, some people they north, some people they south. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but guess what? If we are truly celebrating the season, then Jesus Christ should be the real reason, right? And I don't really hear much people talking about him. All people talking about is gifts, 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 parade, parade, all these kind of things, and um, grand market, and um, I'll be a belch, be a belch now. And, um, you know, um, spending and sale, 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 and all of these things. I don't really hear much people talking about Jesus Christ. And like I said, if we look back at how Jesus Christ was born, he was born in a manger among the animals. Can you imagine that? Among the animals in a lowly place. In a lowly place. So that tells us that, listen, for this season, we shouldn't be killing up ourselves and talking about, oh, we have to get this gift and we have to buy this and we have to buy that. Jesus was born in a lowly manger. How simple is that? So why are people so crazy about going out and the malls are filled with people walking and talking about buying this gift and, you know, they feel bad if they don't buy somebody a gift and all of these things. Jesus Christ never worried about that. Mm -mm. That's an example, a perfect example for shows that our lives, simplicity does it. Yeah. Simply, easy and simple does it. That's a perfect example. Yeah. And I said, I said, so I don't know. I don't really hear a lot of people talking about Jesus Christ. And there that is supposed to be the season or the reason for the season. But how many people are here talking about Jesus Christ? No, not a lot. And that's just my opinion. Yeah. Yeah, guys. You yeah, guys, mm -hmm. hold on one second. I got so much food in front of me. Yeah, guys, why am I for clean up the place when time I finish? Mm -mm. Whoa, it's belly full now. So where the people them then are where all my real is at now? Where's everybody? Hmm? Where's everybody? Give me a take off some weight on my brazier and fall off for me. <laughs> Where's everybody? Wanna still I eat? Yes, we can call it a night tonight. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Oh boy. No. Mm. Hey, how are you going to get the cake? Eh? I'm putting on one. I forgot to buy one of the... May I have your pan live, you know? Your voice is pan live. <laughs> I'm going, okay, so what, what I can do is get one of the small things like that at the dollar store. Because you know, say a dollar store they closed today. One time that it never used to be the norm in America. One time, um, as we talk about Christmas time now, I think one time when we just come up far in the early, in the early 2000s, right? Everywhere you so like you never know when a Christmas appear different from Jamaica. 
Because, you know, you're used to Jamaica being closed down and, you know, street empty at Christmas time, family, their home together. And America was just buzzing. But me know they say, at least where I am, yesterday and today, everywhere, lock and just empty. In New York, when I was in New York, it was live and direct. Here in Pennsylvania, we are here because it's the Catholic community, mm -hmm. right? Where they, that's the day when they're holy, really. <clears throat> you know, so the places are closed. But um, you still have some stores that would open until like 12 o'clock, 3 o'clock, mm -hmm. you know, something like that. And last yesterday they closed at, I think, 6 o'clock, most mm -hmm. of the stores. Yeah. Yeah, but um, hey, it's what it is. But my one case has sliced at every one of the kids, them. And that may I tell you right now. Wait, say, Auntie, Auntie Dada, them bad kids, them. I don't mean to say, I fly to everyone, so I put you to me here all of the family, then stop eating, please. <laughs> all right, so you said, even, <laughs> so you said, even if I want little tubs. Listen, my man, enough for me to say, mm -hmm. All right, okay, all right. So the little piece of to put, um, sweet potato we left, we're not going to touch that no more. Mrs. 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 Not even in a one hour that the whole panda did almost done, Mrs. I have to say, no, 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 I have to save peace for the show. Like, come on, come on, everybody yeah, see the review. You so lucky to get them. Where you get them, how you get them? Girl, Jamaican, they're there. But see ya, girl child. Listen, <laughs> we'll move, we'll, we'll move mystically. <laughs> yes, yes, I hear you, but a long time I want to taste them enough. For real, yeah. right? I mean, I lie. I couldn't, I couldn't, I couldn't go and and taste them this time around because everybody at talk about Auntie Dan and Yamba kept me wine I read to me wanted, especially the Java was what I really wanted to taste. I was like, man, I gotta sample that one. Right. And I mean, I go lie. Right. Out of all of them, her original fruit cake, it, 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 you know, it gum. You know that, you know that wedding cake the way you yeah. get at it and it, and have that gum shunder to it. I so it yeah. tastes and it tastes real good. The Java, okay. the Java heavy, like it tight too. It it tight it, you right. know. The right. the sweet potato and then the coconut, them they're together and then the planting for me, cause I five of them. Right. I five of them. I five of them. Okay. Um, make with me have a sample. Yeah. Okay. So, okay. some people say right. for some I'm people. Get my five, right? Now get my five, right? <laughs> <laughs> when I say, when I say you want your five, me know about four, but like, okay, it don't gonna be a little which, piece. Which, which, which four you talking about? The Java, the original fruit cake, the plantain, and the coconut. You have coconut, you know. So one to the potato, I'm mean, just one little piece leave. Right, then I'm gonna give one little piece off of it too. All right, then the five done. <laughs> Yes. Oh, yeah, man. Because me, I said me never know about platinum, make no fruit cake, ma. Nor dar java. Me know about yeah, ribena right drink. When, you know, when you have talent, I say you show it off in a baby girl. Yes, man. Yes, man. That's what I tell yeah. people. Them say so them need to know what is their talent and use them talent. That's true. The only thing, the only one I me never get, cause I seven of them she had before she had she added the coffee. Me never get this the, the sorrel, so that would have been number six, and then she had a, a, oh, a okay, and the nut. Okay. Me never get the nut, so me get five out of the seven what she did have. Okay. Right, and then um she added a coffee, coffee. I think she said coffee. She added to it, so me never get that one either. Okay. But them five years good enough. Yeah, man. Them them are gone. When you have a talent, I say you have to use your talent. Yeah. That's right. That's mm -hmm. right. We get that whole thing. Eh? We get that whole thing. Look at that man. We got tree. Oh, okay, okay. Supply her with raisin and and she give you cake. Ah, oh, Jesus! You never know. Barter trade. The truth. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm yeah, man. So that's the talent where they're making her the father now. Lord Jesus, people are easy. May I tell her? May I tell her, man? 
and them are killing them and kill through the honor, bite the honor, feed them. You don't understand it, sister. They don't know how some people stay. You never know how some people stay. You don't understand it, too. They need to check themselves. Before them wreck themselves, that must say chat about and that must say what you say. Yeah, just reality, man. But anyways, for the Christmas, like we say, you know, this Christmas, I don't know if it's because of the pandemic, things seemed a little bit slow. And what may I say to them, back in the days in the Jamaica with the pan the cake thing, you know, make sure say your gas pan empty because gas always done when holiday time and past Sunday. Why? Why? You ever think you ever think about it? Huh? <laughs> Right, yeah. Well, at that matter about you know, you know, at least you have the coal and the wood fire where you can deal with a Jamaica, but you understand what I say? And at least when we're, when we're there for it, we're not have to worry about gas are done. Now say go. Well, sure. right. When I think so, even for those who use gas, because most of the houses are electric stoves. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, well, man. By the way, talking about electric, this man in my wake up, I'm in the night. Let's say, wait a minute. I went to something in America, Christmas Day, like that. Uh, oh, what you say? You know, no light in Pennsylvania? No, sir. <laughs> So what on? So what caused that? I I I don't know. So I thought that I was dreaming. Mm. Right? Mm -hmm. And so when I I woke up because I I went into work today for a couple of hours. So when I woke up and switched the lights on, I'm like, wait, I don't have any light. They <laughs> say, y'all want to pay the light bill. <laughs> So anyway no, sister. Yes. Let me ask you something now. Cause tonight topic hot and nice. As we tell us a Saturday night lights and on our normal topic, a thought provoking mm -hmm. topic, topic where nobody don't want to talk about, but a reality. So does size matters. Anyway, before hold on, before we get into that, I'm gonna actually end the live on my Facebook, guys. So if you want to continue to join me, hop over to my YouTube page life with royal cleopatra if you've not yet subscribed please take this time out to jump over youtube life with royal cleopatra subscribe and don't forget to hit that all notification so that when we upload and when we come live you are able to get that ping and to know that yeah things are going over here so so i'm going to cut the live from facebook if you want to continue with us hop over to youtube so i just want to say Again, guys, you know, looking back on the year's review, we have a lot to give God thanks for. We're at this point where it's the last Saturday in the year of 2021, and we're still here. We're having a conversation with each other and looking back down memory lane and talking the real things. Them, you understand what I'm saying? Big man, big woman thing. You understand what I'm saying? All the children are supposed to go on a bed now and all these things so we can talk freely and we can be mature. A, a mature audience all right guys so please jump over to my youtube page so facebook you'll see me sometime soon and i just want to say thank you all for the support throughout the year you know thank you for you know coming on the lives participating in what i do and believing in me because not many people believe in other people but you know we have the real conquerors and the real royalties who believe in what i do and support what i do and i just want to say I thank you, I thank you, I thank you, I thank you, I thank you all. And God bless you. So again, jump over YouTube so we can continue ta talking. So all on the McCall, I'm just in the live here on Facebook. All right, Carla. So we're on YouTube alone. So big people time now. Does size matter? Well, I want to tell you 
you're talking about and it is both it is both i mean most times it's just lately in these last days you see big woman with big belly back then in the days when they used to be more prideful about themselves you never used to see all of these big belly but when men put on weight like that the first place they put it on is in their stomach so yes it matters with men too you know and we can be hypocritical all we want. Hold on the man, hold on the car. It look like you depend on a different size. May I talk about the other thing, the size, those size matters that may I talk about? What size may I talk about? <laughs> Listen! Listen! Where, 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 that's where you are, a big man thing. Big woman right. and big man thing. All right. Okay. Oh, okay. 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 Well, my like, oh, you take it to a different angle, though. My love it. My love it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, I could get down in the real nitty gritty, you know. I was know. never thinking that you would be that rude. <laughs> <laughs> no, man. You know, you're over here, so underloaded, raw. You're <laughs> Okay, 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 all right. I have a sister who is very, I don't know, I don't know, that girl is tough. She says she likes when things pull up everything where she has. Mm -hmm. I just want to feel like shut my force and I go. You understand what I mean? <laughs> me, no. Me, for me. I like to be tickled. I like to be played with. From the time I started, which wasn't, I, I started having pleasure way um, um, later than anybody think, even after having children. That's when I started having pleasure. I didn't know about pleasure before until my last child. I had that conversation with you already, mm -hmm. right? Yes. But it, from that time and... Uh, I really never like to see zippers down. Tell you the truth. Yes. You see what I mean? Um, but the time that I gave myself a chance in that I'm heterosexual, and I know it, and I I have no I had no plans to go any other way, and at the same time, I always say that I want a good man, and I know that it come with sex, so I had to make myself prepare to mm -hmm. know that if I'm somebody's wife, yeah. I'm going to have to be sexually, um, have a sexual satisfaction, yeah. you see what I mean? Mm -hmm. So, so since the very few that I tried, I would, I would feel more comfortable with a six inches and, and, in in circumference, I would say, uh, how would I say that now? Mm. Wait, that you're talking about diameter, radius, what? Yeah. <laughs> um, the length, I, 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 I rather not go longer than six inches. Right, I got that. Right. Mm -hmm. right. And the width, um, 
I'm trying to think. Um, me there, me there up in us, so go on. <laughs> yeah, me there. But me there, there but I can't me there to figure it out. But, um, I'm not trying to think to tell you what. You can't use a finger, you know, because uh, each of your fingers supposedly are three inches. That's what I say. Three inches? Yeah, each of the little. Well, um, no, I don't want to I don't want to that big like when I put my big finger and my pointing finger together and the whole with the between that. Mm -mm, no, no, not so much. Let me try this. Let me see. Wee. <laughs> <laughs> By the way. <laughs> now I said I call her. I'm like her. Mm -mm. <laughs> you know. Because we like comfort, we don't like pain. Okay. You see what I mean? Mm -hmm. Right? And, and you know, the <laughs> thing about it to where I put my mind to is that a lot of women don't want, if that is not satisfac satisfactory to them, mm -hmm. they will leave the man. Okay. Uh -uh. I mean, I'm going to let him. If he have a pencil, I teach him how to use it. Then what if he know how to use a pencil and you're not to teach him? Then at that may I tell you, mm -hmm. right? At that may I tell you, me like to be tickled and play with, you know. And me, it, for me, you know, that much is satisfy me because me play out the whole thing. You understand me? That when you go there, so now I just say, become, boom, that's it, we're done. You understand me? Because me done a fun throw the whole hour and a half, two hours in bed already. You understand me? There are many more things to do. Hold on, the callers, I mean? um, listeners, I hope you're listening. Come on, don't have a call in after listening to my first caller. Go on, call, go on through, caller. Right through. Yeah, yeah, you know. So, so size matters. For me, size matters. I don't want no yam stick in me. Okay, okay, okay. I don't mean, want no donkey. <laughs> you see what I mean? <laughs> what you, no brain yeah. around here. <laughs> no, because some people have been jack a man and show it off and things that, that can catch somebody and as a woman see that she's supposed to turn on. Now come here with that. <laughs> when you say you run yeah. like you see and bold, you say you make a dash for it. Alright, let me tell you a story now. Serious big people talk. Yes. I was twenty about twenty three years old. You know, you know, I have kids early, yeah. right? So I was about 23 year old, live off Byron Road and Mountain View Avenue. I have a nice little apartment, but was struggling as hell. You know, at one point, why I just me alone with the, with the kids and, you know, I look at my, I, my, my <laughs> little daughter got sick and I took her to the hospital and then I had to go buy medication for her. So I went to your pharmacy and they, they oh. <laughs> thinking, the, the price that they told me for the medication, my break down and start crying. You understand what I mean? Yeah. Because I couldn't afford it. And then this guy in there walked over and he said to me, are you okay? And the, the pharmacist said to him, no, she got a prescription and she can't afford it. And she just break down because the little girl was in a bad shape, you know? Mm -hmm. Right. Anyway, the guy, the guy just came over and said, it's okay for me to touch you. And he just touched me on my shoulder and said, don't worry about it. I'll take care of it. And he told the pharmacist that he'll take care of it. And the pharmacist said to him, thank you. I didn't even get a chance to say thanks. The pharmacist said, thanks. But you know, some of the young and look good, really. Look good. Look yeah. good. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So... He said to me, he gave me his number when I, no, he, 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 he said to me, don't leave. Do you care for a drink? And I said, you want something to drink? I said, no, I'm fine. I need, I have to go home to the, um, to my, you know, to get my daughter to the medication. And he said, here is my number. Um, call me. Okay. So I never call him, you know? I, I never call him because he did me a favor, but I was afraid of what the favor your volume shifted. Hello? Yeah. So I was afraid what they, they say. Are you there? Yes, I am hearing you clearly now. Yes. Uh, I never, you know, I never tried to call him back then, you know, it's a payphone. 
away. So one day I was sat on Mountain View Avenue, and guess what? He stopped. He was driving a minivan. And he stopped, and I was shocked. I was like, oh, okay, I thought he worked at some pharmacy. But apparently, he owned most of those vans on Mountain View Avenue, and he had shares in your pharmacy. Right? Mm-hmm. So this guy, at that point, he, he, um, he alone was in the bus, right? When I took the bus, and I, you know, I went on the bus, and he alone, like, he was finished. And he, he, purposely, uh, he wanted to drop me home, so he dropped me home. So now he knew where That's I was good. living, right? Yes. And he said, is it okay to pass by and say hi? I said, no, I don't allow him to come here and have my children. I said, why don't you, when you're in Alpha Tree, stop by your pharmacy and, you know, we could have lunch because your pharmacy used to sell lunch and stuff like that. And I said, okay. So one day I was passing by and I stopped. And then this man and I became such a good friend for almost a year. You know, then he started, you know, getting more personal. You know, of course, he started helping me to pay my rent. And, you know, he wasn't rude at all, you know. So after a long while now, I figure, you know, this guy wants to be a part of me. He's a nice guy. You know, they must tell you their life, say, you know, he's not, he's no longer married. He says he's married, but he's no longer married. But she's on one side of the house, there's a two family house, and him over there, so on them story. Yeah. You know? <laughs> so anyway, I say, I, I need proof. You know, he never show me the proof, though. Anyway. So one day, we went out, and I saw for almost a year. And it was time. You see what I mean? This man is so nice to me and whatever. I have to be fair. It was time, you know? So we went to this place. And we're up in Alpha Tree area. I mean, I'm not the hotel girl need. I mean, I'm not too familiar with them places. But, um, you know. Yeah. So anyway, I, I, we went there. And I was a little nervous. And whatever, and him have an nice red brief, right? The fiery red. And may I say, wait a minute, no. When he took off him clothes, he still laid on the my clothes, you know. So, you know, he took off him clothes and he laid beside me and he said, you're not, you're not getting undressed. And I said, that's the man's job, right? <laughs> so anyway, I mean, I know enough to tell me. He said, well, something jump upside of me, you know, and he said, so, Father, I've got to give him, I don't want to call him name in this. I don't know if I want you, man, being did I care that. I mean, if I become a little young and afraid, you understand what I mean? <laughs> but you yeah, saw what you man. saw. <laughs> but I saw what I saw. I turned to him and I said, where are you going with that? You did? You what you talk- <laughs> yes. And he said, what are you talking about? You're not a wrong woman. You're young, but you have three children. What are you talking about? And I said, you can't come nowhere. I have no one to hold that. <laughs> I, had to, I got to, one drop. And I said, you should have, I said, you should have told me. You should have told me that you have all that. That's why you expect me to you with your one that. And this man, this man, this the man, the man started, you know, like he got mad now, a little bit, like, you know, he got a little frustrated and said, you are a cool woman, stop behaving like that. And I said, I'm like, I'm taking me, I get out of here and I didn't come and block the door with a boom, and I flipped this. I flipped. I didn't know what happened after that. If I had killed that man, it would be, um... So, so long and short of it, did he, did he, okay, so you were trying to escape, but he blocked the door. So did anything happen? Of course something happened. Oh, they, Jesus. They, I, I screamed. I screamed. The attendant for the hotels and everybody came out. I screamed and they come and knock on the door and tell him to open the door. I screamed. If I didn't know, they called the police. I screamed to even people that have there come there for their private time wake up because I got delirium. Okay, I just didn't know. I was just screaming because, frankly speaking, like you know my experience and stuff, I was afraid, young woman. That's why I never run around with men. You understand me? And then, gracefully, now, they're trying to do that and I try to, you know, have a relationship with this man. And that's how women go fuck up into me, lose my mind. Me never, me not, what? <laughs> right? 
this, when he did it, I dressed, I opened the door, babe. Some people turn up outside, people come out of their room, say, that's how bad it was. And this guy came over and hugged me, tall, and some dudes, me, I tell him, say, him, and some him, and some him, he hugged me, him hung over me, and him pulled me to him, and him squeezed me, and him woman was there, right? And he said, okay, okay, calm down, calm down. And the tears that drop out, I'm higher, drop on me, too. I'm so sorry. I'm so, I don't use that. I was just going off. Okay. <laughs> so question. So this man now, after that experience, did you keep him as a boyfriend or was that it? The man vets. <laughs> You know, you have some women where they must say, Why, if a man not have something like that, they don't want him. No, what do you have to say? What What is your thoughts on that? And as it relates oh, to the Lord. fact that, do you think oh, that they're asking for problems? There's no human. I mean, if God made them so egg and doll, they must make them with the world them too. Yeah, because as I was about to say, every who are there stick a bush. Right, and, and, and sex, sex is very unique. Your body adjusts to sex. It, you understand me? It's like it's like it happened by nature, like giving birth to a child. Right, so right. If you are into the person and all of that, your body will adjust. I have no doubt in that. Is it stretch well, to fit? You see what I mean? Something like that. But me one, no, no. And this is all oh, God is good. I'm Mash up now. And you forgot to find another ordinary man that still fit. And that men don't know now. It still fit. Why? Men don't know now. I mean, like I say, I stretch to fit and look at it. If a woman has a baby and some baby can burn big, and at the end of the day, it come right back together. And some man even okay. say, you know, dealing with women who have multiple children, you'd never know that they have multiple children because right. the myth is yeah, that right. That's so right, because okay, this question exactly. Sorry. So the question tonight is not a one way question; it's a two way because we would like to hear from the man them over on the line and listen if there are any tonight or who might be. You know who might stumble on the video i would like for them to comment and let me know for them if size matters just the same you understand what i'm saying because like you say with that the monday with that they multi-size something there right that a cheese where it's a sledgehammer right and the fact that you know i'm sure there are other women out there who that's what they need and if you don't have that, they don't want him. And I'm like, okay. But one of them do that all the times. If that's if they have if they happen to have that as their tool, if they happen to be used at all the times, I don't know. And then for them something there, it needs a lot of blood. So I'm wondering, is that always STIFF throughout, even throughout performance? You understand what I'm saying? Like all them questions there. Well, well, um, I had this conversation with a male before who um, expressed that, you know, when he was young, um, you know, he used to manage and blah, blah, blah. And now, whatever. So I said, that means that you're probably big, right? And him say yes. And him say, you know, when he was the one that said this, you know, when you get to this age and you have all of them, stuff, they're like, for me, I'm, you understand me? The blood flow is not the same. Mm -hmm. So now, so now, now is when we live in a modern time where we have, we are discovering a lot of herbs and all of that that um, enhance your blood flow. And, uh, it, you know, it's very important that especially those men, you know, make use of those services because whatever. But this, I'm telling you this right now, may I always ask, 
people what them size after that hold on hold on hold on hold on the money i jump too fast when you say you ask them them size yes my ask. <laughs> then them always tell the truth. Well, to all my ask, they will tell me the truth. You know, if they want to lie, if they think woman want big things, and they want to lie and give me a big size, and they might lose, and not me because them that the conversation finish. <laughs> hey, so when they give one big number, then when they give the big number, how do you end that conversation, though? Well, you know, remember, you know, me, me is not one of the old one with the face to face, you know, me love phone dating. <laughs> <laughs> so behind the phone, you're, you're full of mods. Yeah. Behind the phone, you're full of mods. Okay. <sighs> no, sir. No, but because, I mean, I hope a woman about say, the man there with them, them size there. Eh? It's like it's soft in a middle of them something there's something to know. And you know, I don't know. And then you yeah, have some woman now will say they might get one like a finger, but it's how them use the finger and the finger work. Right. right. Fit out and whatever. Yeah. And yeah. Both for the man and woman, both for the man and woman again, like we say, we're living in modern times you now where we know exercise is important. Uh, and you know, you know say yeah, you know say women don't and enough women don't know even about kegel exercises okay okay mm -hmm. I, I remember okay. one live i had i don't remember if it was this probably some time ago probably last year i had a live and i was talking about that and i and i mentioned it that it's good for the woman because at least they can do kegel exercise anywhere anytime nobody needs to nobody has to know you understand yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. Right, yeah. but a lot of women they don't know about it. And even the mere right. exercise, when you when you when you keep your body in shape by exercising, that also assists, especially when you do the pelvic lift and all of these things that people don't know that yeah, it does exactly. help. Exactly. Mm. You know, I was telling a man he was you know, yeah. when they when they know that you 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 um you you don't you know, you're not seeing anyone, you know, you don't have a relationship for many years and not that mm -hmm. you don't have a relationship, you're not sexually active, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. They already say, well, you know, you can't find place to go. That's not know. true, because I was just going to edit. It's like you're in my head. I was just going to educate on that, but let me hear what you have to say. That's it, not true. It's not true. Because, because the more... The more I was active with my husband, is the tighter I became. Well, let me explain why that is. The reason being, it's just like your muscles, any muscle on your body, mm -hmm. any muscle on your body, if you're not using it, it get we it weakens, it, it becomes atrophic. Yeah. You understand? So when you're yeah. not using yeah. that and exercising that muscle, then it just becomes laxed. It becomes laxed. Mm -hmm. And so if you should go there, it's like it has no 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 grip to it because it's not active and you're not working mm -hmm. it. So a lot of people mm -hmm. think that, oh, are because no but, um have this thing. you have enough women enough girls always jump up oh me no money money so my something so and so listen if you're not a kegel yeah, exercise I mean. and if you're not exercising that thing those walls are gonna be so weak they're gonna be so lax and it's like if anything for god so it's like there's no grip to it there's no function nothing functioning there so people don't mm -hmm. understand that it's a, it's a trick to it. You have to keep exercising those muscles, just like your calf muscles, just like your, 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 your what do you call the side of your hand, right? Any muscle, if you don't, just like your hand. If it, Just like, you know, when we say bye-bye uh, and, and here, so still a shake like mine right about now. Me have to know, so you have to keep, you know, lifting your weights and keep your body toned. If you're not doing it, it's going to become slack and people don't understand that. Yeah. So them girls will love jump up if them are listening. Them love jump up at all. But, oh, no, if you're not exercising it, trust me, you're falling a problem. Yes, dear, that is so true. Leave it. So, you know, we're educated at the same time. Well, we ask questions and we share. And that's what this program is all about. You understand? At the end of the day, you yes, learn something have. new if you never know it before. Because I think every moment we get, we learn something. No matter how minute it is. If it's even one thing, we always learn something new every day. We never know it all, Fed. 
You understand? So, yeah, man. But size matters because you have some man who love to about some woman at worship and them something they boy. I mean, I know. I wonder if for the man tiny, tiny, or for the woman at worship to true. No, because I was going to say this year. There's another young man, I, again, that um, I was very close to. Yes. Um, and he's a Christian. trying to envision that tunnel, right? Can I call it a tunnel? Because if you might say it, I feel like it, because remember, you know, when you're in, in motion and sometimes when it touch one part, the sun is like, it, you know me at about, like it touch one part, they make you cramp and it, it, it have a sweet sense vibration, it have a painful yeah, vibration. So and it's him like him last, him saying last year, so that's what he's saying. So how? But you know what can happen to you know to this is another thing. A woman that has not been touched for a while too, okay, she can be so um like an explosion with um her um when she. What's the word I'm looking for? Man ejaculate and woman do what again? Squared? That's her name. You mean, when it, when <laughs> you mean the whole explosion, yeah? Right. So she can, probably can produce so much fluid. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You understand what I mean? That, mm -hmm. that, right. So sometimes these things too, you know. But then on that same you know, note though, you have some women with dry like desert and tabo say a tight, they're tight when a desert a desert something them have. 
Right, right. Where where they they because you know it all depends on yeah yeah that too, right? That too, because all we big woman up in a few years, you know, and I, mean, I wonder what dry out them young girls that still become here. They might talk about when women up in that them years. Uh, but but that no, no, go so. Me can attest to that. No, no, go so, don't it. it. <laughs> true, true. You know what I mean? Exactly. Me want to know all that happened too, for real. I think, I, you know what I believe from even a medical standpoint, I think because some of these girls, they douche a lot and they don't know that douching is not good. And people will tell them, no, man, you have to douche. It is better to steam over something than to douche. Douching eventually right. dries out and among other uh, things. Okay. Right. And the reason why they're douching is because there's other problems going on there and they think the douching is going to clean or take care of those It's problems. only making it worse. And, and it makes it worse. You see, the thing about it that these young girls don't understand that they need to take pride and take care of their body. You need to know who you're sleeping with. Mind you, you can't be too careful because your husband can bring things to you. True. You see what I mean? True. But you have to be careful. You have to be careful that it's a part of your body where that gives life. That is a part of your body that a child a life, the greatest king come through. But you have to take pride in what goes there. Mm -hmm. You see? Yes. And they don't do that. They use themselves for everything and every purpose. Mm -hmm. You see? Mm -hmm. And now, and don't forget, you know, that some people, you know, where they might take a demon, they take up the fire, you know, the demon, they still go to go fight war, you know. A true you one. No, in a real life, a spiritual and demon. People don't even understand that part there. That's one different topic by itself. Yeah, so, you know, them go up there and, and, and so I want very spiritual part to everybody that you know, sis. You Amen. understand me? I want serious conversation going on there, so, you know. Yes. You see? Yes. And I don't want a place where should be just easy to use. No. You see what I mean? Mm -hmm. Me tell a man the other day, love till he nearly dead. Me say, you know, sir, if even when that time comes, we'll have to go up prayer meeting first. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I said to them? <laughs> what do you say? You have a sing couple no, for us and go prayer meeting first. No, sir. Yeah, that woman doesn't have no yeah, sense. Yeah. <laughs> Lord, it's your hand I commit this moment. <laughs> 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 No, so you are the best. You are the best. You get the cake. You may have to go send the cake them for you for real. <laughs> no, sir. Mm -mm. No, sir. No, but but I'm serious. No, and I'm serious. No, people need to start think about mm -hmm. that place. How important it is. You see what I mean? Mm -hmm. How important it is and treat it with respect. Well, you see, what well, body overall is supposed to be the temple of Jesus Christ. So. At the same time, yeah. that when I remind myself of that, we just get up and fling it all about the place. You know what I mean? Like a yo yo. You know what I'm saying? Mm hmm. It's a yo yo. You go out and come in. Go out and come in. You know? Mm -hmm. Yeah. A two be in it, bring your son, man. At the same place, falling in the band from, you know. Wow. Hmm. <laughs> you see what I mean? You have to be careful. School winner, man. You have to be careful. I tell you. We have to be careful, mm -hmm. but I mean, you know, upon the side. So, like me, I said, no, me ask a question, you know, come in. I mean, you're nobody else, a call me. You're the phone line, I'm born up tonight. It look like people, them afraid of the topic here. But, like I said, no, man, you know, they're, they're full. are them too <laughs> full, right? Drunk. Exactly. So, I'm them just... drunk. <laughs> <laughs> some drunk, right? <laughs> Yeah, but you see, like I said, when you come over here, so we are one big family and you are all my realists and we'll come over here so we talk the thought provoking topics, the topics them where normally everybody run from, but you don't know at the end of the day are just reality. Chat boat and mm -hmm. that must say what you say. So tonight, if you have something to say after listening to the call a year, but that's why you're for Dale. The number is on the screen, 239-404-6147 via WhatsApp. I'm going to hear what Una say, does science matters? And I'm sure you've been learning a lot just from this one caller so far because, yeah, 
and she hit uh, she hit a hole upon nails on the head and i really love that and you know she's being real real as real can be and that was say chat about just reality tv with royal cleopatra your number one sensible specialist in the stratosphere i want to take a break if you are a newcomer welcome to this space i wanted to make sure that you hit subscribe and not only that make sure that you have your notification turned on so that when we upload or when we come live, you know, every Saturday night, our aim is to come live on a Saturday night and we drop uploads every Wednesday for sure. There may be, you know, other in-between drop-ins, but for sure every Wednesday we do an upload at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Saturday night we try to come here at 10 p.m. You understand what I'm saying? So please make sure you share, invite, and let others know what we deal with over here. So come for the juice, come for the sauce. You come for everything over here, sir, because we're going to give it to you. You understand? You ask for it, and we provide it to you. It's what I'm saying. So it's a sac passe, bonjour. You know what I'm mean? saying? Wagwan. You name it. All the different languages we try to say. You understand what I'm saying? So all the boys and girls that we want a teacher, come right here. So but make sure when you come, you come for your best behavior. We talk with respect. We treat each other with respect. No disrespect around here because we're all grown people. We're all human beings at the most. And a big woman and big woman think, big woman and big man thinks this. You understand what I'm saying? So just follow me and don't make dog bite you. Go on through, Carla. Yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. I, I, yeah, I, had a, I think I had a question. I wanted to ask you a question. I think I wanted to ask you a question based on the last thing that you said. We spoke about yeah, because size matters both ways for men and for women. Because you have, like you say, you talk have your man friend, and when you talk to them, complain about the woman when I have the bottom, or you have some man who complain about the woman and will come like them wider than the ocean. And you have some of them will say them dry like desert, which in you know, and I really must twite it twite, but it just dry and. You know, we'll touch a little bit, even though it's not the topic, but still under the topic, we're going to find little different avenues where still correlate with the main topic, wherein, you know, there's a myth to say the older women get, the drier they get. Not no gossip. I can raise my hand and say, not no gossip. You understand what I'm saying? I mean, I know as we age, things might change, but as you rightly stated and, and put it out there, it's the way we treat our body. And when it's supposed to start flinging that shit here and there and everywhere either. And it goes to both male and females. So you have some man then come like yo-yo. You have some woman then come like yo-yo, like gig and all these things, you know. But for me, in terms of size, you know, the woman them on a don't know, if you never know about Kegel, it is what? K-E-G-E-L. I saw Kegel. Kegel, K-E-G-E-L. You can look it up. Kegel exercises. It's a thing where you can be sitting here and you just do so. Lego so. Do so. Lego so. You drive. You do so. You're, you're sitting at your office in your chair. You, are, you stand up. You're, you're in a supermarket line. You do so. You let go. You do so. Hmm? Even though I know. Right, if mm -hmm. you if your package close enough, right? Yeah, do the in on the out, you know, you know the things we have, right? <laughs> <laughs> but other than that, if you have on all on jeans pants, you understand. <laughs> <laughs> you know, yeah, if you close enough, sis, if you close enough, right? Yeah, do the in on the out, then mm -hmm. you know, sir, mercy, and you know, some so sometimes people don't want them moderation, this but no bother with stuff. Well, but, um, and a and a and a and a, and a big woman talk now, mm -hmm. you know. Yeah. You have a lot of women have some big something to be called them lazy. Yeah. When them man come from them, they want the man do all of the work. You have to wine. Whoa, we're in the season, so wine. <laughs> you have to, you have to wine. You understand? Yeah. And that's why, and that's why you, the girl, them with the big, then we are going this big flop. They need to stop it and adapt them to exercise down that they can. If you're going to go with my. But you see, I know that too, you know. But you see, I like me, you know. That's why me have to make sure send me exercise because guess what? You see, when time me have my partner, me not have to worry about gym, you know. You understand what I'm saying? Me not have to worry you about gym, then can they? Stop it, though. Stop it, not this. You understand what I'm saying? So that's why I like, 
you know, when me when me have a little weight down, it's like it's hard. Me have to make sure say every day me go either to the, to the gym or me make sure say me walk or me make sure me do some form of exercise throughout the day. Because remember, just like exercise, just add the S to it. Just add the S to it, and that's you do when time the time they come around. Mm-hmm. You understand? Mm-hmm. And it's a good form of um relieving stress and all them someday. Yeah. yeah. Even though, even though me, 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 me ex is mad with me stay a little while because then he was talking one day. I'm a stay. It's like you are both a story in a color. Me and him was talking one day. I'm a me boomer. Me and him was talking one day. I'm a stay in one day. You know, I'm in the gym, I'm in the sex, and I know, so I know, and I like when me and you was together, when me used to use you for me, Jimmy, so, girl, did I just hear what, because you Trinidad then? You said, did I hear right? Did I just hear what you said? So all those times we were having such a wonderful moment, you want to tell me that you were you? <laughs> <laughs> You just hurt the man's feelings. Must run themselves down because you have the men, them you know, then just speak to say a woman can do and them, them, obviously them never hear what Shabbat they say. They never hear what Shabbat say now. They not realize that for them time did always I come catch up on them as well. You understand what I'm That's saying? True. Yeah. That's true. Yes. That's true. And then you have that big thing and you still can't work that big thing. That don't make no sense. Yeah, and and again, and everybody like big things. So for some of them, man, they sometimes I wonder if them, if them, if them, you know, how they get you in a life because if everybody see them and I run from them, then all them manage. That mean I like to know. But then yeah. again, as you say, you mentioned something about whining because you see some of them. With them big someday, all they know if you do a dig yam hill and that not make it. And uh, it's not about digging yam hill and the D-A-G-G-E-R. It's about you see, is that is that love making or is that some you know what I'm saying? Because some people don't get it either. Because it's not about we're jamming, no, we're not jam. Mm-mm. You understand what I'm saying? So sometimes too, with that big thing, you're only gonna be hurting people. And did you know that some men have to get ring like medically to put on on some of them something there? I heard about that, and that man that I'm telling you about in a real life. No, it happens. I heard about it. I heard about it. You know, I heard people talk about it. And then you have some woman who them brave enough them say, "Listen, me not run me. You better me inch it." <laughs> <laughs> All you guys who are on listening, what do you have to say? I mean, soon I put no comment up. Everybody just got their ears like conversation just nice. Nobody now said nothing. One of the other friends are one of those Christian and do them something. One of them none. What's going on? What's going on? Oh, what you mean Christian? Is that, that, no, I want another topic. That's only Christian. I'm going to lose them, man. Bad, 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 bad. We talked about that last week, man. We talked about it. Well, not in a topic, topic by itself. We have to have that as a topic by itself. Because you know what I noticed? Even though I do have a number of topics written down, every night when we come live here and we have one particular topic, there are so many topics we get out of this conversation as well. You understand what I'm saying? Because we did touch a little bit on that when we were talking about the jacket children the first week when we came live. And, you know, mm-hmm. one, one couple called and they were discussing that a lot of reasons so why a lot of Jackie come into play, it happens in the church. 
you understand pastors who are married and the, the single church pretty girls you know what i'm saying and all of these things so you know yep but if you all think size don't matter then drop me a comment and say no and let me know why you say no and if you say yes it let me know why you say yes if you are afraid to call in because i don't know the same call i should not afraid for all the things i mean on a summer like when my real real is them come punch come through and call in and talk the things them we're not shy around here because when i not do they do we're not shy mm -hmm. we're not shy them can they yeah man talk some kind of language and so nobody not shy them time there so we talk big people yeah. things over here so and we keep it as i said respectfully we do it respectfully mm -hmm. we're not for brawling us so yeah 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 if you have some people that will say that that is brawling too because and oh really we are cut again you know nobody that you know they need to wait for because because you know the, the church is falling apart because people are not holding their partners and the, te and the, the, the preachers are not teaching about that either. I think some of the, the, the Bible lessons class should turn into family counseling classes. Like, you know, where, in a sense, counseling where you come out together as like a Bible study and you make people express themselves and you, you know, give sound advices and so. But everybody feels to say because you're a Christian, you know, do them something there. No, no, go so. Come on now. Because, oh, here's a question that I wanted to ask you now. Because how it go now? Caller, wherein you know how them say we're not supposed to fornicate, and so, so when time you are date a man, no, you're in the church, so you're a church sister who live in holy and righteous in the church, and a church brother see you in the church because we're not keeping it in the church from the question here. How you manage now if you don't know what kind of so, so is it okay for the woman to ask during the dating or courtship the size? Well, it's okay because I ask. I ask. I ask. Um, you know, I I was kind of dating someone in Jamaica for quite a while. I might keep it as a secret. I never tell you mm -hmm. because me I saw me see them say me sneak in a kind of way. <laughs> we keep it very. <laughs> we keep it very private until there is reason to announce it. Right. You know. Yeah. And. You know, that's what was going on because there were other things that I need, needed to know, you know. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, when I found out, you know, a little more than I said, I can't go on with this. This is no longer. I am not interested in this, you know, because if we're talking about, if we're talking about to be for the rest of our lives, I have to know what I'm doing. You see what I mean? Are you not ready yet? You understand what That's I mean? what you said? And I yes, I did. You're not ready yet. You know, um, you can't um, protect my assets or you have to protect my life. You understand what I mean? Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. I have talked. You know, he's very hurt and, and still not even accepting his blame. But you know what? There's a lot of other women that make these things happen to They make it easy men and make it seem like they are the one that want the man okay you know what i mean mm -hmm. and it don't matter if he's not serving his purpose no it's uh it's not a one-way street here okay anyway so one of the things that i wasn't comfortable with like i said you know i'm full figured and he's full figured i think about my what bed, a piece my of bed of work. The poor bed day my god you know what I mean? <laughs> no, me like, I like them. I like, me like Jackie. You ever see them? That's them. I come and ask for the Jackie. I wish for them to see a big Jackie ride. No, it's a Jackie. No, it's a tiny. Hold the whip, you know? So, mm -hmm. I just want to say, but if I have a full start man and him put to me and him have himself together, it's one of the things. You know, I'll compromise. You see what I mean? Mm -hmm. But you can help yourself together as you want. And, you know, I mean, I'll put down the man, you know, I put him down, and I put down myself, because, like I said, he's a full figure. He's a full figure as well. Mm -hmm. You know, so mm -hmm. that part of it I was uncomfortable with. But if everything else was okay, and that part was, you know, that I, I could live with that. Okay? Mm -hmm. Well, anyway. So you. Right? Uh, it's just a matter of going on the track, though. You know, the John did a try a long time, up to the 100. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Make it done a try. 
<laughs> you understand what I mean? Mm-hmm. Okay? So, it gives John a trend. I know I'm having a serious conversation now. You feel what I mean? Right. And I kind of like... You mean currently, currently, currently? Currently, yeah. I'm having mm-hmm. a serious conversation. Right. You know, and I think I can do that because I'm not going near anyone. <laughs> you feel what I mean? Mm-hmm. And what I do, I become this friend, you know, this friend, when I say good friends, that I make people comfortable that them talk. And good and them bad. You mm-hmm. know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. So, you know, I'm up in conversations and I have those questions. I ask, you know, because guys want to know that, you know, that when you ask those questions, I guy will quicker to tell you that, well, then we have a nine inch, you know. Mm-hmm. <laughs> They're supposed to lie them at all. Wait now, wait now. So that's what I'm saying. So when you find and so, you know, because my inner conversation, you know, they know you like the medium size, you know. You understand what I mean? Mm-hmm. You know, so. Which is which is the medium size is round about the medium size is round about six inches, right? Uh, that's it, yes. Yes. The, the right size to me, where, 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 that's a decent work for me. I thought, you understand what I mean? Mm-hmm. Right? Uh, me no one go to the doctor and then tell me some tissue they wear out. Because me have work with girls, I said, the doctor tell them that. Wow. Mm-hmm. Tread out, them tread out, tread out. Yes. Them tread out, tread out. Yes. <laughs> yeah, them thin out. Mm-hmm. You know, you know, where it's a lot of problems there. And the doctor actually, I, and this is serious. Mm-hmm. I was working somewhere where the doctor actually, they took the woman husband to court. What? That man gave that woman no rest. Yes, and the doctor was furious because the, his patient was getting hurt. She, mm-hmm. her, her vaginal walls were thin though. Wow. And but the doctor took the husband to court. Am I hearing something here, Dad? Yes, they took him to court, yes. You know, poor girl, pretty, nice looking girl and everything, but it seems as if she had one of those, mm-hmm, you know? Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know, she trusts me a lot and we talk a lot and she, you know, she would ask me what to do, what to do, I said. You know, and those things are great education for me because I would not want that to be me. Now, did she thought about that while dating this man? I guess not. Yeah, but probably you did tell her something that she never know until she married. Because that may say, if you're a Christian, you're not supposed to tear your son by, that's all. That's what I'm saying. So but that... me, this, this, <laughs> a Christian. I mean, I try to be a one, but when that time comes, I want to feel up good. I want to feel for long to see how long it stand up. You understand me? I feel. I want to know who I am married. Say, so when you go out to dinner, so on this particular night, you go out to dinner, what you say? Yeah, make sure you hold on to one good length of time throughout the whole conversation. I mean, when it come close to that time, for the final decision, mm-hmm. you know? You want to know. You see, you have to keep yourself because you have to understand this too. You don't want to have a relationship with a man dating a guy. You go and you have to touch, touch him up. Man has feelings. He's going to want to turn you over. You understand what I mean? <laughs> what <was it? laughs> You know? But when, it, when, it, when you go close down to that time, then no. You know, when you know it's the final decision, no, the rubber is the road. Mm-hmm. You see? And you know, say when you go to the altar, they just ask where you walk from the side, and you get you have to take it up, unless you end up in a divorce. Mm-hmm. You know, which or you unless you end up in a cheating. You see, which you know what? I know mean, no, wouldn't cheat because of it. Me well disciplined when it comes on to that. If me can't leave it for myself for so many years without sex, and it don't really matter, I mean, I really care about it. You know, I'm mean, not going to have a husband, and because I watch happen to him, then me going to cheat because I can't be satisfied. There's many things out here. I'm going to tell you, I'm a player. I'm a player. 
when the time they come. Oh, y'all have a woman job. player on the phone, guys. Go ahead. <laughs> Go on with your bad self. <laughs> <laughs> You know what kind of play we talk about? Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah, man. The play that when that time comes, it's like basically everything done up now. They just that one last moment, they boom. Mm-hmm. You understand what I mean? Right. So, it's not, you understand what I mean? But, um, we're coming down to that. <laughs> well, on the color, somebody just commented and said, this nice. <laughs> 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 Watch your call, I got them a listen, them a listen keenly. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, but a real talk. I saw the things that mm-hmm. you understand what I mean, mm-hmm. right? You know, many times guys and girls ask me to be gay, I laugh after them. Be gay? No, baby, love, me just don't run around. Mm-hmm. But when that time they come, you're better ready because I'm troubling in my bedroom. You Whoa. understand what I mean? I don't stop worrying. You see what I mean? Now you have to know your business and all of that. So tell me from the get go, so you don't have that. Talk to, Talk to a lady. Talk to a lady. You see? Oh, I mean, I'm just curious. I'm gonna ask a question, which could be a topic in itself. I'm love, me love them conversation. Come let's go back and listen to them and just jump out one topic. How long have you ever ever be celibate for? Oh man, long long time. What? I like how many you. years? Just, 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 just. Hmm? To tell you the truth, to tell you the truth. Okay, that's a, this was, I went from 19, when my cousin died. 1996. I went from 1996 to 2000, 2000, about 11. Hold on, Nicola. Let me do the maths. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Well, you said 1996 to 2011? 2011. And I could tell you this. So 15 years. That's how long? All right. 15 so, years um, being celibate, abstaining. My gosh. Uh, yeah, and it's not coming like nothing to me. That's the thing. And even when I was young, young girls, young and rich, three, four years. So when you say, hold on, hold on, come you want to understand this real quick. Huh? Me knows it when it comes to that. You know? Um, So when you say 15 years, you mean no touch, no, 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 Mm-hmm. But, but I, I don't go out and buy sexual toy. I don't believe in it. Neither do I. Neither do I. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. And um, I don't fondle myself. You right. know what I mean? Right. Um, right. But you know, it, it's it's just it's just it just happened though. You know, where I don't invest my mind in sex. I don't know if it's because of young experience why I'm groomed like that. I, I, I can't explain it to you, but it really doesn't matter. But 2011, you understand me, I came close. And I'm telling you this now that honestly, because I want to tell you all my fear, you understand me, but purposely fix the person there. We Papa. Are the six the person the proper where we never have to suffer the guilt of sex. Okay. You see what I mean? Because I knew that it was wrong. I knew I should not have been in that position. I'm not, wasn't married. I'm in my church. And you understand what I mean? So oh, the things them sister are real thing where I would say just reality TV yeah. they're mm-hmm. Yeah. That already, because you know, never business themselves. And I find myself in the position where, you know, my, my ex-husband teach me well. I, I, I let me learn, but it not all the work teach me well. <laughs> <laughs> Confession is you good know, for the soul. Yeah, yeah good purpose. You yeah. See, he taught me well. Mm-hmm. You know, where, yeah, I met mean, people fly off of the hook before it makes me have to suffer serious skills. You understand me? And then from that, I never did. 
even bother with nothing. No go. You know, worry about it, sis. You know, worry about it. No, me really saying when me look at my age and all of that, me say, but me don't live no life. Me need to whine. <laughs> Well, on the caller, I wonder if people they might hear. Really, it's one of the day. Wet on a day. I don't know you just hear. Where's the caller? I said, I don't live no life. I need to wait. You know, my still flat. <laughs> you know? So, I we got a full wine. figure. Belly flat with one wine around here. Go, girl. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> Ouch. So. It took me this many years to find, to really look into, and I'm kind of satisfied with most things. You know, the um, the intellectual desire meant that I I wish for. Mm -hmm. It's not a hundred percent, but everything else is. Yeah. You know what I mean? I kind of like. I kind of like that person. Hold on there. Hold on there. Hold on there. Everything I dash for you. So hold on the color. Can you make everything start go a wire? Yes, so you hold on there. Are you with a bad self? Hold on. Hold on the caller. Hold on there, my people. Boy, boy, boy. It's a one hot like lava. Hold on there. Hold on, guys. I'm going to have to pin something right here, so please spare me a moment. Hold on. All on the collar. Go on to our collar. Go on through now. Yeah, that me saying, you know. So the size, yes, size really matter because that me said before that last minute the wedding car. And before I go to the altar, like before we start to send out the invitation or something, you know what we're doing. You understand me? But that special night. Me, I go touch it, feel it. I'll be one of the whole long it set up. You understand what I mean? <laughs> yes, ma'am. <laughs> you understand me? Something I will get play with. You understand Ooh. what I mean? When I hear that, something is going to get played uh, with. The only thing that the only disappointment I can come you get play with. with that, you understand Ooh. what I mean? Go ahead, go ahead. The only disappointment that will come after that is the whiny whiny because some of them don't know if you whiny whiny then jokey jokey. But then, hold <laughs> <laughs> on, man, you go too fast. Hold on, hold on, you go too fast. Sometimes when they are stressed, some things they have to say it over and up. Where is it? Some of them, them no whiny whiny, them jokey jokey. No, sir. Where's the no matter? <laughs> And like me said, them man there with them big jump man, them big cylinder. All they know if you do a juki juki, you play a juki jam man. And I saw. Mm. Yeah, man. They don't know, say you can't play a juki jam with that. Mm -mm. When I was young, you know, there was this guy, nice looking guy, you know, one of them, you know, call him near, when he's up with a politician and just, you know, going like him and all that, you know? Hmm. After years in my bottom, I see years, 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 until one time it just said, what's the point? You know? Mm-hmm. I said, get back. Yeah, I was a dog. Juk, 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 pow, oh. I 
Listeners, watchers, she said for tonight's topic, if you don't want to learn off a wine, you get one bottle with one cock on it. Screw it off, screw it back on. Screw it off. I, I, saw, I saw the message go. Yes. All right. So you there you go. If you never know off. something tonight, off you do, you know. That is the practice. You, ever, you know, I know what I don't think but listen me say me say when me used to small you know and we used to go river got beard man you used to have one boy we live in a community man that the boy they couldn't take off him something. Cause you know you got a river go beard, everybody take off clothes and a beard a river them tell you and have no shame and little picking it. And me I tell you say, well, it wasn't a boy, because he did older than us. And him always be he was like a pervert though. And me I tell you say, always come a river, you know. And one day, me no know somebody see my beard a river and me said that the boy they, I don't know. Nobody never know who female woman be. I'm not telling the truth. Like in you know, the community. I guess he was like a gelding, never have no woman. Because I guess mm -hmm. nobody no want that, like you say. Mm -mm. One fan. Oh, he was big. Want something like for donkey, like you say, ever see donkey? At that, may I tell you? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. What's up? When I come around and come with that, so I mean, I, I, not even if you're rat, rich, where I just yell, you know, there's no possibility of breaking up. Not even that. I don't know why I end up at the doctor like no, the doctor for the call that judge before so let me say. No man, me, 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 um, yeah. I remember one time we used to work at the bank and this youth did it and him, he I think he would just get married. And you know, man, sometimes, you know, you know, especially when you have certain people you can sit and hold certain mature conversation with and him say, Fim wife, she had to go to the doctor, he had to get a ring. Wow. Yeah, because he mash her up. Wow. Mm -hmm. So them girls that were always to them want them there's something. They wonder if I me don't know what they carry. But them always ever say to say every who of them take a bush. But then again, if you mash up your wife, then want to them the girl that them what them me don't know. Or is it that them just know say them are gonna rim. Them are gonna rim it. Me don't know. Especially now this when sex gets so um where they want every hole on your body, you know, it gets so it's just out there, you know. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Crazy. God Jesus, I don't want next not topic. Like one time. <laughs> sex is not sex is not like one time. You know, like we tell you not this, that bedroom. Like we say when you're coming, they're coming they're ready to pray before you go start through. You understand what I mean? Oh, Father, who are in heaven, hallowed be thy name. different kind of language.
Because, um, yeah, so you know, it's just... Yeah, talk, yeah, talk to um, the first Eve, <laughs> the first Eve spirit, but the first Eve when it's in the marriage to Adam and when she disappeared and she go into the cave, that woman, they get pregnant to do much pity and never sleep with a man. Hmm. My God. Because the spirit them breed her. And pick them band, fallen angel, them there. There's nobody not going to believe you when they talk these things. People who don't know them somewhere, when they talk these things, they don't know. You see? Mm -hmm. When she uh, has sex with your husband, he must sleep. Yeah, and but that's why, even when they talk about... Even when they talk about the incubus and the succubus spirit, people not understand there's something there. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Marine spirit and all of them spirit. That's right. A of something them Mermaid and all that something there, yeah? yeah? Yep. You know. But, yeah, guys, yeah. those size matters. Anybody else want touch it? Because everybody else is keen and people them say, so them all is keen and misses. So, I guess tonight, you, you bring me go to school. You bring me back to school this <laughs> this, this Christmas night but into... Oh, you mean? Oh, you mean? You know, say, you know, I mean, if I get a chance to get the proper experience, you know, like young girl merge into something and have them like a teenage boyfriend experience and all of them. You never get them good stuff. <laughs> so, you see, I know why you're a tab. <laughs> <laughs> Whenever I get them good stuff, them kind of people just want to come hear you and just put a gun on your ears or a knife and just take you because you're a decent little girl, you know, so you never just like, drop your everything to nobody. You but know, but guess what? You're you never disposed to any which is. Because if you buy books, so we're supposed to, we're not supposed to find a kid, you ain't gonna miss nothing. Yes, you see what I mean. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> you know, so we need to. People, people take what they want when we never have no control. Them just take it. Mm. Just put a knife by your face or whatever and then just take it. Because I feed them and they can't do it. And if they, if they, if they not, they find it, they're going to go dead. You My understand? God. If you know me, the control, no mean control, and we can determine what we want. Mm -hmm. You better come good. Okay. So you say, are you run things when door closed? And the two are we supposed to run things, you know, it's a 50-50 thing, project are supposed to go on in this. So, it's a point to see if they come here, man. You're ready, you're, you have yours ready and waiting. Not sure. No, sir. So, I said, oh, me agree with that. You see, and then people don't understand, you know, like, women who... You see, as I tell people, women are emotionally stronger than men, you know. Women can abstain longer than men. Men don't know which man, that's another topic we want to talk about. Which man ever stay for a certain amount of time unless I want a real godly man? I mean, you have men like that now, but they're very rare. You know what I mean? You mean that's a weird for a woman? Yeah. <laughs> And then you call them man the full full man, but what you call a woman them full full to no. But yeah, size does matter. I mean, you know, um size does matters, but you also have to think about the function of the size as well, because you can have big things and don't know how to handle it. You can have big things with us big and log wood, so like log wood, and yeah. you have big things, you have little things like pity me little. You remember them pity me little ants? <laughs> Yes, yeah, so you have some little things that go on what's it like pity me little ants because when them pity me little ants they bite you and know, them swell you up. You understand? Yeah. Not sure. Yeah, so you have some pity me little where can go on and like you say, you know, make sense you have big things and one come play um jamming or jokey jam. You have to can turn that thing and you know make Love with it, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, but but do you ever notice though? Most of those men will have them thing where them have grown at a throne and things that they have something for a whole woman. Them big something they have. You ever notice the woman where them end up with ninety percent of the time when she disrespect him? Hold on, expound panda wonder for me. Again. Those people with those full size things that is going around and controlling their communities with it. Mm -hmm. When they reach up in age and they end up with a woman, 90% of the time, if you ever notice, oh, he's being disrespectful. Because what? Not, not do they? I then tell him, say, so having big old dead whatever. <laughs> I 
Okay, sorry guys. Achu, that achu, 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 yeah, dog. 90% of the time, you notice those guys, we have them jack on my walk on when they can't handle it. When they turn in the late 40s, 50s, they end up with a woman, they're not so bad again. You achoo, understand me? Achoo. But and you then see? They're dead, they know, and they start to get disrespected. Worse if she was in the running stool when he might run around with everybody. And he end up now upon she, where my fair not kind of beat something. She said, do something for me now. He said, she must, she sarge. She must, she sarge. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what? But you see, are them things that me can't take now, you know, because you listen, you just hit one what one next can I wear me you now because look, for talk truth sake, me and your wife and me and you live together, you feel say when I did be a little bit younger because you have your jack on my you feel say you are the man and you're macho, you this and that. You know, stop run up and down and all and something you now. And now when time your something just get lengthy and just out of function now a malfunction now you want to come now for come sit down with me is that fear do or not for the woman then or for come sit down not with them eh? not only that but then go on like a fear and fall to a castle up and watch if it were a miracle don't it touch it you see what i mean one time let me tell you, you know sis you know you know you know me set up enough ladies big woman that me complain to me now big woman talk to me you know sis Talk it through, though, man. For real, man. Yeah, for real. And you're up now. You're up now. You see them big old man there? Don't send you like a 13 year old boy go over the yard when he's gone to work. Lord <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Whoa. No, sir. This is a topic that's not going to happen. You're just dead there and I bet the woman and tired her out and whatever. And she not a thing. She just wants. And he look a 13. It says, me talk to people, you know. Me hear me tell you, say, me, me have a couple men when me talk to you, know. Mm -hmm. And me hear the story them, you know. You understand what I mean? Yeah. You know? Who leap at them? You would be shocked if you know how much Christian in you know, the church. Yeah, they would arrows, but when we claim, say, when he find himself, can John Tom, can perform, then he run, go circle down to the church beside her. Mm -hmm, you mm -hmm. see what I mean? Mm -hmm. And she said the animal want her for work, miracle, get her and all of them heat then otherwise only come on to that one. She said she's gonna perform Jesus' word for go raise the dead. Yeah, that like a land last minute where you wait and to just scream and just get it over with. In ca you can't happen. So I leave you there in a heat like a little um March puppy. You see what I mean? And he's gonna work tomorrow now and they drive the big truck or go take up the fuck or gone with them and the star, whatever. You go pick up baby next door now, past like a 13 year old. Hey, come help me fix this in the, in the upper room now. What's up in under the bed? Go take it off. You know, drag up on your poor like a 13 year old. No, guys. Sis, may I tell you, a whole lot of young men tap into a Jamaica. Know some people will tell to me, me shock. Wow, wow, my God, no, sir. And now that's the young man falling at the same trend, get damaged, get damaged like them because now it's gonna get him promiscuous because a big old man whine and I want serious whine, you know. When it's a big old man whine and I want serious and big old man versus young girl, and I want simple big whine man versus and young I want girl. <laughs> Every young man will express that always end up have a promiscuous moment of their life because at that unexpected time, you understand me, Mas John, when we in life, can't satisfy my wife where the deaconess in the church. You see what I mean? Mm -hmm. And that one little minute that she just want that one minute. Well, I don't know, man, what the panel line I listen, I walk on, I listen, come and notice, I don't know, I want to talk tonight. No man, no one jump up on Colleen tonight. I wonder what I saw. Mm hmm. Yeah.
But me don't like to hear from a man perspective. Does size matter? What's your experience and them something there? Mm -hmm. We don't like to hear. 239 Hold yeah. yeah. on, they call up. I want to the yeah. realest one. And we realist. You're not comment here now. Come on now. When the wine well cure, you must drink responsibly. <laughs> That's fired. Po. 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 Listen, salute. <laughs> but like it, the realist. No, sir. I saw me like responsible people over here. Real talk. I just reality TV. Right over here is a chat board. And that must say, wanna say, does size matter? I saw when the old wine cure, on if I drink responsibly. Men, where are you? Where are Uno tonight? Where are Uno tonight? My ear from Uno the first week. My ear from, did I hear from the man last week? I don't remember. But one of the tonight, does size matter? Uno should I jump up a call? That's all. Mm-hmm. Like they're afraid. <laughs> you done them tonight, Carla. No, sir. Like you shut them up tonight. <laughs> Woo! -y. No, I so I'm let a really say, comment here. Mm -hmm. I want to make tell you something. The kids who want me grow up with us school here, me talk like the seven of the eye whooping. Is that Shara? Oh, oh, <laughs> yeah, <it's> a... <laughs> no, sir. No, but you that? say, but you say, even if so, you know, let's say we're a little uh, naive when we were young. After a while, you know, you experience certain things. Experience teaches wisdom. That's how I go. Yes, ma'am. Mm -hmm. So are you yes, not fool if you're not learn? No, I mean, see, no time, not if you waste around yourself. No, sir. You understand, Miss Size really matters. If you go out there, don't be greedy. Not because the man have some money and all of that stuff. You're going to just grab up and just expect say so you're going to be comfortable for the rest of your life. It no work like that. It no work like that at all. Because you're either going to damage yourself or yeah. something. Mm-hmm. And on a man, on a just got done out on herself, a woman can done. No matter how she, no, no bottom so she still can done. Can done. Mm-mm. Come by now. All she have is like a, is a little hole. Yes, you need something there, so, other than the hole. But when a man can move or can stand up for long because his foot shaky, then how that go? And not only that, not only that, you have doctors now that can narrow the thing. You see what I mean? And then right, for the females, for the females. The same thing, yes. Right, exactly. He can't do the same if he's dead, he's dead. If he's too big, he's too big. So him sit down there, go and educate. But they've got to educate themselves. Go on the internet. Mm -hmm. Look for what kind of massages to do to, to, to release them. Them blood. Veins and mm -hmm. to drink them blood and not because that's the blood flow that that cut off from you know because I think they're big and but you see that's why people with um the blood. men who have um diabetes or have insulin issues uh, di you know being diabetic um they're most times affected by you know um ED which is erectile dysfunction. And, and you know, so true. and and also, you don't even have to be diabetic. You could have hypertension because mm -hmm. one of the one of the medications that I know, um, its side effect is ED as well. So sometimes it's either, you know, the hypertension, which still has to do with circulatory issues, any which ways, and most times if you're on medication, let's say you don't have hypertension or even diabetes, but you have some other ailments. And therefore, you are on medication. Then some of these medication side effect is also ED. And also, don't think that it's only men that it can affect in terms of erectile dysfunction. You have women who can be affected by some side effects from medication that um, does not arouse their libido either. You understand what I'm saying? Because you have women. That's another topic in itself. Who have never experienced an orgasm. So that's another topic we're going to talk about. You understand women you know who don't because some women don't even know why they don't experience orgasms 
And that's why we're here to teach you guys. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Okay. You know, but um, wow. you have some mental. What I wanted to ask you, what do you think? Callers, listeners, you know, um, listeners, what do you guys think about men also who they think that, oh, they have to have a big cylinder and so they go out and these days they sell the thing um, that they, when them claims that them sell where it make them, them cylinder gets longer or bigger. You know what I'm talking about, Carla? Uh, uh, extender that, or extension, uh, whatever they call it. That is because of the, uh, the behaviors where with sex now, sex becomes so um, literally erratic. <laughs> well, oh, then. Then. What are your thoughts, Carla? Come off and read this. Hi, <laughs> remember the really same up on top of your saw. So, what really say? No man now got just come near man that table and can't deal with what's on the table that well that is well prepared. No, hey, that really say full of chat. Why? Boom, this a one bummer job. No, sir. Let me read that one again. Well, no, I wanted was to say that a long time ago too. Do you know for the when things they, color? When they treat, when they treat, when they treat, don't just say they, they, they get professional with them. Them say, uh -huh. okay, so let me fix it up. Them say if you lose it in the waist, they gain it in the face. Simple as that. Mm -hmm. But that my yeah, real is okay. not in of that. My real is say, no man now go just come near on the table and can deal with what's on the table that well that is well prepared. Shots fired, boom, slack boom. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> Christmas not good again. Miss <laughs> 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 Summer Real is them full of chat, Rona. So, no, so many things I mean, full of chat. No, sir, me like it. Go ahead, Carla. What you say about that? I just say you didn't want to touch it. <laughs> no, that's what I'm saying. You know, I will it for them when they go kill the tree. Mm -hmm. You understand what I mean? Then come on, come use the stump. No, sir. You know? no, and it don't no work like sense. that. I mean, your mouth and your mouth, and God didn't make the stuff to the job. The mouth come in afterward, you know. <laughs> the man can just get, <laughs> man can just get a little advance and figure say, uh, if one thing don't work, I can't do the next. <laughs> but I don't think I can work with the business. <laughs> no, so that makes it true, food and fee. To chime the food with the salivated and saliva and that so you can digest properly. No, sir. My really say them bad. Me like or no, me love or no. No, sir. Them conversation and me like. Mm -hmm. Those size matter. Nobody has no one jump on the topic. No, no, no. Or just say, it's one. See, see, a time for go no, <laughs> no people listen this lady living at a cold state outer door conversation sweeter for over oh no man you're bad caller no sir mm -mm. no sir when conversation nice cold nobody not feel cold no sir no, real, it's real talk, it's no real man, a real talk. talk. These things we have to talk about. And like I say, while we're conversating and holding, you know, dialogue, we're teaching at the same time. I'm sure I'm learning. You, my realists, are learning. The call I learn also. We all learn together. You see what I'm talking about? So if somebody out there, if one man out there with one big thing and never know, say, I heard the woman them and know, say, this is somewhere you're here. In this conversation that a doctor actually brought that man to court because he was damaging in damaging his wife. And mm -hmm. yes, it can happen because I also had a friend who said he had to get a ring for his thing so that he could have stopped damaging wife. Because remember, it's not only the vagina that you have to think about. You have to think about the woman's womb. You men who have that tingling, -ling, that bingy -ling, ling that's hanging and dangling. You have to think about the woman's womb as well. Because remember, that same passage, and if you go too far, then you can go the cervix area and mash up the woman's cervix. You see what I'm saying? Then here comes she can't get no picnic or any more children. You see what I'm saying? So you have to think about that. You can't be selfish. 
Well, this one I must thin out that woman walls. Her walls was being thinned out. That every time it touch her, she bleeds. Wow. And, Ooh. Yes. Jeez. That must be painful. That alone, just listening to that, that's painful. Wow. And then, you know, what happened, what I think happened, and because she was so turned off by his maniacism. Oh, so he was a mean? nympho. Yeah, she yeah, she she wasn't producing any kind of fluid. Her body wasn't producing anything to make it easier for her. It's a mind thing and, and it's because her mind yeah. already shut down her system and that's the reason why she wasn't able to produce. So people don't understand that. It's your mind, you know, the whole condition thing, you know. If you make it's because she was being hurt, she already her mm -hmm. body is now responding to her thought. Mm -hmm. And so it's like her mm -hmm. body just shut down literally, so there's no secretion. No, you know, no, you know what I'm saying? Nothing. And that's not good, you know? You want little lubrication whenever you're going there. Mm -hmm. And too much of that KY gel, no good neither. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's just like douching. It's too much, you know. And you know, you know what? You know what? That's another thing. Um, KY. Um, this girl asked for one time, she said, let me ask you something, because I used to work somewhere where I used to take them home. Mm -hmm. She said, let me ask you something personal. I said, you know, I have no man. I said, why? She said, so why, can't, why you carry a woman of the KY? I said, the people who have a man of them carry a KY. He said, she said, because I'm a woman dry, so they don't have to use it. I said, no, honey, it's a, for me, it's a, it, 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 it helped to produce good hygiene at that place after you finish your bath right mm -hmm. you put it on your washcloth and you that's the final wash you wash yourself fresh 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 mm -hmm. you understand what i mean so it's like some people take baking powder to the bathroom that's to have that freshness right you know Right, so that's that's that like that. Can I didn't know that. I'm learning something tonight. Yes, it can be used as a cleanser, and we will talk more about that. Mm -hmm. You know, right, right. But, yeah. As well, you guess know, what? As We're gonna actually have a topic because, as you speak, um, another topic that I had is that you know how many rugs does a woman have. And a lot of women don't know that you should, the rug that you used to use on your foot, you should not be using that on your vagina. A lot of women don't know that. So that's another topic in itself. <clears throat> you, did you know that? I'm sure you know that. <laughs> well, me is a clean freak in us. I to keep a certain kind of spirit. You understand what I mean? So right. anything for them kind of cleansing is there. Well, but know? as I talk about the pop quiz question, I mean, I know that our body produces fluids and we have different scents, natural odors, especially when we're having sex. But what I want to tell people, if me I smell sardine, then something wrong. <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? If me I smell something like fish or sardine, then something is wrong. Why there's so many things to learn. Why I'm telling you, but tonight topic man, I lie. Carla, you take the cake. You, you see you? No, sir. The way you talk, people that think say you're bad from long time. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 my husband would teach me a whole heap of things because him did bad. <laughs> <laughs> No, he sir. teach me how well for things. I you don't even know I said that man was so good. You understand? Because him don't look at him, not act it, but mm -hmm. it was just he said, act like he must see and you know. Yes. Sense. You know, but mm -hmm. man, when he take you into the bedroom, you have to you you it's like heaven up in there. <laughs> you know? That's right, man. Like he teach me a whole life. Because I didn't know anything. At twenty three years old, I did not know anything. I see. You know? mm -hmm. And then teach me and the Trini finished me up. The Trini was another story too. So <laughs> them two people that set me up on the road. I mean, no. <laughs> girl? Girl? <laughs> oh, man. No, so well, you know, 
up tonight. We, we thank you for, you know, edifying us. We thank you for giving your, for sharing your experiences and speaking on the topic tonight on Science Matters, schooling our audience as well. You know what I say? Yeah. I've been using two rugs for a very long time. Yes, ma'am. And a lot of females don't know that. Uh, a lot of us females, same rug we use and uh, wash my foot or the same rug where I use their son. We're not supposed to. Mm -mm. You understand? So we have to have a different rug for my foot and a different well, rug. Well, this is how conscious I am. Mm -hmm. I actually take three rugs to the bathroom and one of them has to be white. Mm, right, me too. One of my rugs has to be white. Yep. Yes, ma'am. Yes. And the white right. rug, you know, we used to the white rug already. Yep. Yep. Right. Mm -hmm. Because my taste too. I am very careful of what goes on my face. You know? Mm -hmm. So we have, you know, because your foot is a place where you can have all kind of something funny. So you're supposed yeah, to have foot, your you foot. have foot disease. And you have in what you call it courage in what you call it in between in the, the, the fungus. All kind of mm -hmm. something. Yeah. All kind of something. You know, mm -hmm. and um, we have to be careful. And then another thing I want to teach females, I know a lot of us don't know, even men, I would say too, when you go to the bathroom, I know we know females, we wear front to back. But when you go to the bathroom, I always tell people, wash your hands before you use the bathroom. People will be like, what sense are you talking? Yes. Mm -hmm. Because you will be surprised to see how much dirt is on your hand, especially for females, you know, you're going to touch that delicate area and you'd be surprised to see how much dirt is on your hand. If, if, when you wash your hand before, you'll, you'll be surprised to see how much dirt coming off your hand. Yep. So if you've never heard before, you can share and tell somebody, make sure you wash your hands first before you use the bathroom, especially the ladies. Yeah. I know sometimes you might be rushing and me want pee pee, me want pee pee, but try wash your hands first. Yeah. I'm telling you, right? Mm hmm. I like the topic here tonight, man. I like. And that's something I like when time my callers are not afraid to call in and talk the things, them. Yeah. Real life issues because I'm sure somebody else out there know what we're talking about. You know, uh -huh. I've experienced what we're talking about. But we don't want to talk about it. But it's okay. We can have dialogue. We are grown people. Mm -hmm. And like I said, if you never know something, you learn something tonight, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. Right. Yeah, man. So I have to big up my callers then when them call. Right through. Yeah. Appreciate it. Respect. Much love. And so I guess somebody is not calling tonight. Everybody just listen. Nobody don't want to talk. Everybody are going to be my virgin. Finish Christmas and then jump. Because some of them have strangers in the house. They know. They're church and stuff. But they don't want to church and stuff. No, 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 no. But that's what. As we say, these things need to be taught in the church. You understand? Among church brothers and sisters. Because then when we're edified, we know what to expect, what not to expect, what to do, what not to do. You know what I'm saying? And so we can mm -hmm. have better, happier relationships long lasting relationships yes because enough women they've never experienced orgasm and them fake it that's another topic may have that right down as one topic you know how a man know when a woman a fake it and why women fake it lord all of these things some real topics well well this it, 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 that may, may understand if some people fake it because man love excitement and sometimes you have to fake it for him come why you know what, what, what. <laughs> but why because, do? <laughs> because you don't, you don't want to go too long. You don't want to go too long. You reach and you just. But all you have to do is just clump him two times and make and make him know, say, you got to go. Just clump him two times. No, but, but no, no, but look. I no, man, if you clump it, listen to me. Sometimes you have them one that will love go like say them a marathon and long distance runner and so. You clump them two times and make them go sit down. Or drop asleep. Yeah, but, but you know, say, you know, say, um, you know, say, um, it, when a man is experienced, so you have it, yeah, and, and you, you have, you have your partner, you're gonna know what turns him on. Mm -hmm. You understand this? So you know, you know, 
you know, if you make the sound there, you know, because they will hold back in and you will do things and then fix it. Oh, yeah, man. Them love do that. Them love do that as well, like say. Yeah, them love do that. Yeah. If you know, say you behave a certain way, it's a good kick him off. You just be said you laugh at them and go and boy yourself and say, Joe, watch him now. You understand what I mean? <laughs> Why are you always kidding me, man? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, no, get a ramp. No, sir. Anybody ever? My girlfriend, my girlfriend told me about, you know, she too was without man for a long time. She wasn't a Christian. She just chill, you know? Yeah. Okay. You know, so she said that she met this guy and. Well, on the caller, like, one caller, oh. Colleen, caller. May I go take the call here? Yeah? One call, oh, one yeah. male, Colleen. <laughs> Yes, Carla. Thank you for calling in tonight. I'm glad one man called in. I'm glad we had... <laughs> right through, Carla. Carla, you're listening to the live. Hello. Hello, good night. Good night, caller. You're listening to the live, man. So you're getting a delay. Yeah, man. I see the funny topic size matters, huh? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Got you. I wonder if you don't listen to the first caller come here. I'm not lying. Sure off. Well, me just get the log on and me hear the topic and... I don't know what was said before, but mm -hmm. you know, size really matters because you know I can speak on behalf of my lady. Mm -hmm. She sizes matters to her. You know? So what about you as the man? As the man? Mm -hmm. because, I mean? because size yeah. can matter to the man too. I mean, I talk about from the man's perspective, you know, because if they, if you did a list, well, you, you probably didn't get to listen the entire um, previous caller's um, conversation. And what she's saying that she have men friends who complain to her or, you know, have dialogue with her and say that um, one particular one had been to a woman when feel like she didn't have any bottom. You know what I'm saying? So... On a man's part, too, it size matters to them as well. Because she was saying that she don't want no donkey looking something because she don't know where to put that. And also she has other people who would say they were destroying their female with them big cylinders. You understand what I'm saying? Okay. Right. So what do you say on both um, aspects of size? Yes, I mean, size matters to me, too, in a sense, you know. You mm. can't have a size one and overuse it, but True. you know, mm -hmm. the, 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 the meaning is that once you have the size and the lady want the size, you have to give her what she want and satisfy her in the way she wants it to. True. You have to know if you work it to one and all of that. Then suppose you, you as a man now define yourself, say you never have size. What would be your your comeback to that? Well, I mean, whatever, I have to work with it. I'm well, the caller before said, them for stop play Juki Jam and them for wine. Right. <laughs> yeah. So. so you believe, so you so you would agree with the previous caller then? Yes, you have to go for wine, man, and uh, 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 um, use what you have, you know. Right. It's what you have, you know, you can produce what you have. Right, um, so you have to so you have to use what you have. Use the be versatile, you know. Mm -hmm. And 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 ladies no want no, nothing dead, you know. They want people who can perform. <laughs> God, they, they will laugh at you. I make you a man. <laughs> Listen, I thought the caller before said. <laughs> They will laugh after you for true. And they will laugh after yeah. true for you for true. Laugh after you for true, Carla. True. A true. Or they will cost you because she, she also yeah, stated. We have to, 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 we
you have to know your thing, you know? Yeah. And, you know, if your partner, if you're not even know how your partner willing to, you know, teach you one or two, if you never curse the tile in that, you know? Because, you know, some people don't really grow up, like, out in the world, like, have a taste and run the road and all of that, you know, so. But you, you have know, to run the road for you have a taste, though, Carla. I mean, sometimes, you know, I mean, practice become perfect in the sense where if you don't have the knowledge of the thing or you were not taught in that way. Because, I mean, for me, growing up, me didn't get a, a lot of teaching when it comes to young, when I'm a younger age, mm -hmm. coming up. Mm -hmm. you know? So, you know, you know, when you when you hear the parents and you know they hide from you till they say a plane can a baby come and all them things there. So they never you tell it, tell you what is how baby come and a mama and daddy have sex and all of that. No, they they hide all of them stuff there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So you grew up and you, know, you grew up all in a church and you know, you they exposed or anything. I mean, you don't know not much because sometimes back in the days church not gonna teach you. Right, she was mentioning that too, yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it, it, church don't teach you, right? And then you grow up now and then, you know, you get married and thing and right there and then, you know, get up here. Then they call it mama, papa style in our church. Right, mm -hmm. mama, papa right. Style, no, you know, you want to lady and things, all of that, just that you know. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You know, mm -hmm. you go to the school, and now you grow up and you hear yourself. You have a position, box shot, and all of them things. Hey, you know? position. <laughs> you know? Hey, so what position you own, Cleopatra? CEO. <laughs> you know? yeah. So, growing up now, and, and you will start learning these things. Probably your wife in the church, probably not even know all them things at all. So you don't know where your mama, papa style, and probably mm -hmm. buff beer. And sometimes you have nothing to do with it. Right, so right. That 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 exposure but, but 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 do you think a man as okay as i mentioned the, the, the hotness of it do you think a man who is well endowed can use that 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 tool that he has without because remember you know the caller before had um experience and she gave examples of men who said they had damaged their woman mm -hmm. but do you think that man also can use that tool without that that extra large tool without even damaging that woman too as oh, oh yeah oh yeah i mean some people or some male if you understand making love is different from when you are just doing a jack hammer work okay because you got some people them just go there bam 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 and them just a hammer Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, no. Mm -hmm. When you're making love, you start to kiss, caress, and all of that before you do that. Right, right. Entering to make sure that the lady is well lubricant and all of that to enter. Right, right. Mm -hmm. After you get in, no, you don't just go in and start hammer, 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 hammer. No, you you have to. They said to every just, turn and curves and turns of fern yeah, bully. You know, right. <laughs> and uh, you, you know, just go and push everything in it and just start hammer. Right. Because at the same time, remember, if, if you're married to this lady, you're not there just a one time or two times. It's a lifetime as until death do us part. Exactly. You yeah. know? So you, the same one you hammer and try to mash up it. You're going to need it. Yeah. You're going to need it. Hmm. So you go there. I'm making love. So once you spend that time and caress something, nobody na do that again. They just want to get into it and slam, 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 bam, thank you, mom. Sometimes the lady want it that way. If she asks for it that way, it's a different thing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But in a other sense. It's is the key for me. Because once once you spend time to caress her and all of that, it it is more easier for you than when you just have this eager to get into it and 
Aham or like, you know? Yeah, when because I see it's she, it's Sarah, like and... right. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. right. But when you start to slow and she's getting the mood and you are and you and her in that mood of making love. Well on the call, like, I hear a conversation so hard it a fling with all of the phone. Go on ahead. It's a fling with all the phone caller. Go ahead. Sorry. Yeah, so I mean you have to spend time to make love to your lady. Mm -hmm. That at the end of the day, she can be satisfied, you can be satisfied. Well, you don't want satisfied. Me, I want to be delighted. But you know, say something, Carla. Can you say something real quick? Yeah. You know, one time, you know, me did meet this man, right? And me not gonna lie, big man. Because um, for the most part, the men them that have been in relationship were like older than me, right? Yeah. Like about five years older. And uh -huh. may I tell her, say, it's just like the caller before, uh, somebody where me meet, person like me, but me never really interested at first. Me don't know why. I think because at the time I was involved with somebody else. Because one of the things, that's another topic where, you know, if I'm with somebody, even if somebody see me on street and like me, I'm not interested. It's like, me not go show no interest or anything like that. You understand what I'm saying? But anyway, long as I the story is that after a while, it so happened that me and the man get involved. I mean, tell us that the man, when me tell us that the man there, we not talk about love making. I've never seen another man or experienced another man, to be to be honest, because when me go say no, the man they make love to you and make you be all over the place and him not even enter you. Okay. People don't understand that. <laughs> Some people don't understand that. Say so you can you you can make love to your lady, you don't have intercourse in the right. sense where you enter the lady, right? And she after you're done, she don't want none of that. She's well fed, right? Right. And, yeah. So you 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 have to listen to also to the woman mm -hmm. when you're making love. Listen to her talking back to you mm -hmm. look at how she react so She's you're reacting. saying conversation is important during that time as well. yes conversation is important in making love mm -hmm. you can't make love on your are you are you dead mm -hmm. you only hear sound when you're when you're when you're in pain are you grown right you know right. you if, if, if somebody are grown it sound like in a pain you know but, you, you but know, again, you know. it depends on the, the sound that's coming out because some sound you can know say I'm peeing too, right? Yeah, yeah, most definitely. But I mean, if it sound like you're not peeing or here, if you soak on a way, it's like it's become uncomfortable. Are you okay? You're you know, you're talking right. about You're and, supposed to stop to figure that out too, true? True. Right, exactly. You know, I mean, yeah. Yeah, are you enjoying it? You know, and you know by doing that, it helps you to respond in whatever you're doing. For me, she talking back to me, it helps my my say ego or my responding to her. Mm -hmm. It helps me too. So mm -hmm. when she's talking back to me, yeah, that's that that's that, that, that's that's what helps me to satisfy her in the way that she wants very valuable points me love me love them addition here to what the first caller was saying very yeah. valuable points so i may always yes. like to hear from the men them because we learn too you know yes yeah so it, it's not just about just the size everything matters mm -hmm. in whatever so once if, it, if it's small you have to use if it, enjoy yourself yeah. and your partner enjoy regardless you might love something big but you can use whatever you have to make the sex more pleasing enticing all right, all right. Pleasing. Mm -hmm. yeah so so yeah. have you ever in a your lifetime call a call mr when you come over here so real thing we're talking about have you as a man ever experienced a woman who 
you believe that she was wide like the ocean or she just never up she never sing all kind of something yeah yeah so have you were you honest enough to tell a woman how you feel yeah yeah drop the one the pound when i call her <laughs> yeah because after after me it was like me know it and I would say she went and have an affair with somebody else. You know, and when I went there, I was like, no, this doesn't feel good. So, you said, no, we're having an affair other than me. Hmm. And there and then I found out that something was going on. Because when I went there, it was like a tunnel, you know, and they said, no, man, this don't feel good. It's like you can't feel the side now at the bottom of this. And I, and, I, and I said to her, something is wrong. This this, this, not, this don't feel good, you know. And then after all, I make a loud sound on it and she eventually come out and say well this was it and that was it and no well she never feel good after you know she never, she never feel good after no i never feel good because of of the experience because i've never experienced something like that mm. you know when you come forth and realize it was like that so when you when you know when you know your woman and know what they use for, whenever you know feel good, you can you can know that there's something wrong. So so was Which that your woman at the time? Yeah. Was that your woman okay. at the time? Yes, but we are we were having problems and so forth. So you know, back and forth, and you know, I never realized that it went that far. You know, so I went to a counselor about it and then the counselor is saying not at all times it's because she cheat it feels like that mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Said, well, so i said to the counselor i said listen to me i know my woman i know my thing and it has never i've never experienced not like that never i said i dropped like we dropped in our own tunnel so, because earlier now, what the first caller was saying, and she taught us, which I knew, if a woman is out of action for a while and she's not performing Kegel exercises, neither is she doing like pelvic exercises or any form of, you know, exercise like walking, even that can strengthen any muscle. If the muscle is not being exercised, then that can cause a lapse and looseness and losing elasticity and all of that. Did you know that? No. So at that time, when I went to the court and I was explaining the situation to him, that's the time he was saying that to me. He was a he was a male at that time, so he was telling me that it was not necessary that she cheat while while that feels like that. Mm -hmm. You know. Because his wife is a nurse, so he's saying things that he learned from her and, you know, mm -hmm. allow him as a counselor to widen his uh, thing. So that's when he was telling me that. Because but what I'm saying, this is somebody who wants to go up staircases every day, <laughs> come down, <laughs> up and down. So, you know, if you're talking about exercise, then I mean... Just coming up the steps like five, six times, double every day. That's exercise. Yeah, man. True, true, true. And the muscles yeah. that I work too. Yeah. Right. <laughs> right. Yeah. I, I don't know, say an old person where it takes long and all of that. Right. I mean, right. The, right. That, 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 the thing, the man, you, you wonder, you know. Now, no time it, it come up together and tight like, you know. So, so that then I need to say, she probably did not get something bigger than where you did that. Yeah. Uh, exactly. Yeah, that probably that, you know. Uh, yeah.
Yeah. Oh, yeah. Say, boy, I hope we're not learn tonight in our listeners. Yeah. Mm -mm. Wow. But you say that I always would have liked ask men on a whole and I, I'm happy I had the opportunity to ask you as a male tonight because you know like even in my experience it's like me just always want to know like okay what what is your experience as a man you know what I'm saying when you when when yeah. when you're there you know what I'm saying you understand yeah. you know and me uh -huh. always want to know if they would have like let's say if that was the case with me, like if they would have, oh, if they would have the, uh, the you know the nerve to say, listen man, <laughs> thing no good. Yeah, it's something not right. It's something not right. <laughs> because mm. we believe that people for tell people the truth, you know, no matter all it may sound or how one may yeah. want to feel, because then. Well, at least when you know, you will figure out. Say, so listen, I, I gotta do something. There's something that I have to do. Right, right, right. So, uh -huh. so, so the saying where you have yeah, some woman. Hmm? Yeah, that you tell the person. It's better that you tell the person, you know, because it it can be a turn off, you know. Right. Because okay. woman uh, and and you they, they, they well excited and when you drop in, you're dropping out on place like <laughs> one tunnel and in another bottom. Um, yeah, wonder. In a, in a second, you, 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 uh, you, you find sitting say, boy, you, you know, say, and find some excuse for your left. Because some people not tell them, my find an excuse for cut. <laughs> what kind of excuse? Give us some example, Carla. Yeah? Give us some example of the excuse them for cut. <laughs> 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 you know, you know, shock is like probably all 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 all, 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 all feel shame and drop too. <laughs> In the sense, you know, not hurt again. <laughs> you are caught, caught yes, sir. <laughs> no, sir. Yeah. No, sir. <laughs> Listen, I've heard yeah, that one yeah. before. Me, me hear that one day before, Carla. Me like when you drop yeah, that one day. I've yeah, heard yeah, that you before. Come, you come up with that skill quick and say, you know, say something come up and we forgot to me, me have to deal with that thing, you know. Jesus Christ, man. And, you know, you know, mm -hmm. come back. Or probably some, some man will play it off in a sense. Mm -hmm. And say, all right. And no matter how you are off him again. He might not even say to you, say, boy, at that time. He just not look your way no more. Okay. Yes. You, mm -hmm. no, you, you look this beautiful, attractive, and a man might have looked on you this long time, and say, boy, I try to get you. Mm -hmm. And the one time he go there, it's like he lick him brain, he thinks, boy, he went better than that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And I look your way again, and he might not even tell you why. But Why some will be outspoken and tell you straight to your face? So, that, boy, this is what it, wow. you know? Yes, yes, yes. So you think that some man will lie and tell the woman how she good when she not good too? You think so that that can happen? That possible? It's it possible. Possible. Wow. Because if he's, if he's a player, if he's a player and, and, and him, him go around and him have many history, yeah, him can do it. You know, he's a player, and you know, he's played and played off like, yeah, one want to go to When you book him up, you want your friend on the road, you want to like him, when I say. No, sir. A real, yeah. something real, a reality, a just reality, chatbot, and yeah. that was say, where you say, listen, yeah. a true talk, a true, a true, true, true. Yeah. True. <laughs> I get the feedback, yeah, man. But you know, I, um, as as we're on this topic, you said something a while ago. I have a quick pop question because that makes me make me like them conversation and them strike up others. Like, uh -huh. do you think, like, you know, some man will say the first time, like the woman see them, the woman give them give up, give up, give up, give up the thing, right? But yeah. Me also, like what you say a while ago, something just come to me, but a man can also wait, you can play it out on a man to few much months, six months, or probably a year, and when the man go, they're not, not there, and he gone, he gone after the first run. 
Yeah, because guess what? He looked at himself and said, at this, may I wait six months for? Mm -mm. It's like, him just get the one who run and he said, no, sir. He not even wait a second. So, 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 so what do you it. think if a woman should give up early to a man? Like, what is your thought on that? <sighs> love, we, we call it love at first sight. I only call it love at first sight. Um, it can be. Yeah, I mean, you can look on it in different ways. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? A man can just see you. Your view, your view, your view. The man can <laughs> see you and just have feelings. Have <laughs> feelings see you and just and you you just pop it just like that too and and just give in to, to it at the same time. Do you think you know, those relationships can last, or you think a man should always be chasing it better when a man chases? It can happen that it works out, yes. Other, and on the other hand, it may not work out because it's love at first sight. Mm. So, from my view on it, is that it can work out sometimes. But men are so all. What do you think? Men are all for chasing. chasing. Yeah. Well, well, for, for, for us, yes. It, 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 it's good for, for a woman to put up some resistance mm -hmm. to, for the man to see, to prove that he really love her. So if he really love the woman, and the woman decides to write in herself, she'll give him six months with him if he, if he we still hang on. Okay, right, right. <laughs> yeah, but as we said before, it's like some man is just a player and just want to get. I want to kill and him gone. No, they still. always are playing long because I know mean, they want me to whip them then well whip. <laughs> well, I the woman in the box says she always won out because she knows that when she a whip, she whip. <laughs> well whip. You get whip. No, sir. So, Carla, yeah, what do you have to whip. say about that? Huh? Huh? What do you have to say about that statement? Well, I mean, she, she speak of her experience, you know, so I can't, I can't, I can't say anything, you know, is what she, what she experienced. You know? But, but hold on, are you a woman that's in her back? Yes, ma'am. Okay. <laughs> so, may I ask you a question? So that means to say you well whipped. Yeah. Size yeah, yeah. matters, in it? Yes. Yes. Okay, then. Yes. Okay. No call I think no easy. I no, she, she, she will tell her straight to your face, you know. Mm -mm. If you know if you know good, she'll tell us why you're not good, you know. You have to go work on something. Yeah. <laughs> no, yeah. sir. They might call yeah. your face bad. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 She had that shorty. And no. uh, when you do good, you tell us you do good. Huh? Well, you so, know, you at least, yeah. like you say, when you just start, you know, you say, you come back to where you just say, when you, when you just start, say, you say, you know, make no sense. You have to know how to please your partner. You understand right. what I'm saying? And the best you tell them, like you say, if you know good, so that they can work on something or do something. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, and I, I think the, the thing about it is that the, 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 the homework that we all should do is that you know, the, know your partner, mm -hmm. learn your partner, you know, so you know how to approach and how to deal with it. Know if your partner is spontaneous or your partner loves to explore right. and stuff like that. You have to because know. I think that's what um, caused relationship to break up. Mm -hmm. is that you have one person that is spontaneous and another one is not. Ah. Hmm. spontaneous. You have this woman who you want, you want to three times a day, almost six times on Sunday. <laughs> you understand? While you have one, you have one lady, she only want one, one two times in three weeks. 
Mm-hmm. 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 It, it helps you to lay a proper foundation. Yeah. It helps you to know the individual that you're, you're, you're courting. And it gives you time to go out and know the person that yeah. you're getting. Especially, and, and sometimes sometimes what I do think that happens too mm-hmm. is that um, if a man see a woman that him like and the, the, you know, the woman like him too and she hold out, sometimes that like turns into love, love when you get to know that person true eventually and, and love comes into a beautiful relationship mm-hmm. also it can also happen that the person the woman might give in quickly and the man still want to get to know the lady mm-hmm. and it blossoms into a beautiful relationship as well True, true, so true, it true. Depends on the intention uh-huh. at that moment, and you know what is going to come out of that because the, 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 the one day, meet and slam bam, thank you, madam. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it do blossom sometimes into a beautiful relationship, and even the ones that go very long, the chasing and the running around, it, it ends like mm-hmm. after the one, one it ends. Uh-huh. So, it all so, that's what I'm saying. Intention. That's what I'm saying. That's why I believe that there is no hard and fast rule in, uh, that's just me. I don't think that there is no hard and fast rule per se in, in a relationship, because even though, even though dating is very important, because then it still allows you time to get to know each person and to see if this is a person that you want to be. And as I've always said, it's still, you can be with a person and it still takes a lifetime to still understand a person. But some things, you know, you still would get a gist of who the person is and how the person, you know, behaves, reacts to certain things. You know, if you're around the person, you know, dating, courting the person. But like right. you rightly said, Carla, the female here, you have some men who probably don't go for one, one kill after a female and say the female should look good, you know, carry herself well. And it, and in his mind, he was just going there for a one slam. You understand? A one night stand, but then get hooked, get whipped. Yeah. And then one takes it and she probably did also, no one have nothing to do with him. And she decides, listen, this is what me, like, don't call me back. Don't do nothing. And then one takes it from the woman to you. You know what so that happened, right? You understand what yeah. I'm saying? So the woman who no one have nothing to do with the man in no text set. I remember now in a few men a one slam him go there for. Right? Yeah. And then now, as you say, you have the woman who they believe in, okay, let him chase, but then when the man really finally go there now after chase, he must say, hold on, like I say, um male caller. I want this. You know, what is this? You know, or for whatever reason, in just that's just that one thing and in gone, you know, in nobody will not go this anymore. So I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what to say, as in, you know, I just don't think that there is no hard and fast. I don't know what you would say, Carla. I don't know. Yeah, there is a- there is none. There is none. So as we say, you can go there one time and it work out and you go and you wait. One year, I'll go there one time and didn't work out. Yeah. So, so you ever go anywhere yet, Carla? You ever go anywhere yet? And you get it one time on your hook? You ever go anywhere yet? And you get it one time on your hook? <laughs> 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 Carla, me one year too. Go ahead. <laughs>
Let me sing. I can't let them have a jump off on that chair tonight. <laughs> no, sir. Listen, my audience, our audience, our realists. The year one, one, I did something I've gone over here. So, say, if you're not ready for the juice and the sauce, don't come over here. <laughs> so, I'm going to do Listen, if you never yet hit up the notification bell, please. If you don't know, hit like, say, for everybody who is on right now, please, mega ask, you know. Hit the like button because listen, without your response, without you participating, sharing, subscribing, and liking and commenting, then guess what? The video now go gone away. What is the there is about ourselves? And we want people to, you know, get used to this and rock and come in and build up the audience because that's the only way. Just like you do for everybody else, may I go ask you know, may I plead with you know, please like and share, invite, like and share, subscribe. Please comment, like and share. If you're listening and something you agree with, you can say yes or true. And if there's something where you have a rebuttal or something else to add, you can drop a comment if you're afraid for Colleen. But please, if you're on right now, hit that like button. Please and share. Share with somebody. You can share with your WhatsApp group. You can share with your Facebook Messenger, your Facebook, whatever. Share this live. Please make a big one. Because everybody do it and on a response. So make a big one the same thing. To share the live. So we can get out there so more people can come in and come share the views on a Saturday night. Yeah? Please. And thanks. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Carla. Yeah, man. Them something, yeah, real something. And, you know, as I say, if we're amateurs and we have amateurs in terms of in relationship, and a, a lot of people would say, okay, why a lot of relationship conversations? We have to. Because you know what? Today, there are too many broken relationships. There are too many misunderstandings in relationship, causing divorces, causing separations, when guess what? If we had only knew or known, if we had only known, or if we only knew, or if, you know, somebody would come on the, the, the live here, we hear some something we never hear before, we'd say, oh, okay. Maybe I do it wrong, you know, or you know, you can go back and teach a woman something, or you can go back and teach a man something. Relationships will work. I say, gonna you, you also one of the greatest learn that you can learn is learn from somebody else's mistake. You know that? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's true. And, and I believe all of us are here to help somebody. Amen. But it it, it is that it's up to the person or individual who is willing to learn yes because if you, if, you, if you don't willing to learn or to expand or expand on whatever you have mm -hmm. it's just not gonna work is either you're gonna take bond for the rest of your life or you're gonna cheat for the rest of your life or i mean i know but something it not gonna work exactly and so far you know i mean it's it, you not know, worth it you know it doesn't work it because the day idea I run from one gym, 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 all of them. And, and you keep running, keep running. Mm -hmm. all over the place, right? But I didn't know that you, you come out right out of one person, same way. True. Right? Or sometimes you end up with nobody at all. True. Because you're just a player. True. Till you play all yourself. Hmm. Yeah, because I mean, someone run, 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 run to lane and then. 50s and sit now and they end up now, you know, nobody physical along with because they run the street so so long. But no one ever going to circle along at that time because I mean you're hoping you're 50, 60s and thing. And then now you come with a dead self. And that's what the previous caller was stating that what she witnessed is that a lot of these men know when they become in them fifties, some of them early fifties too, because they run themselves so red when they were young. And you know, up to them forties, yeah. and then now they're not a use, and you want to stick to the woman where they did it with you from yeah, wear arrow shirt and all these things. And that she find out mm. that these men now are being disrespected because the woman starts saying, Move from here with a big old dead something, and so and then guess what? They want to blame the woman, and that's what she was also saying. You understand what I'm saying? And that's true, yeah, yeah. So, we really. have to just be real with ourselves, and we better with us stick to one, somebody find. Find that person, stick to that person because if you're gonna run world, you must find one out of the whole lot before you're done and decide to settle down. 
You understand? Because it's really yeah. unfair. It's really going to be unfair now when you come with a dead self. You want somebody to be a nurse and doctor. Eh? Or to be a magician. No, sir. Does that make sense? Yeah. <clears throat> no fear. No fear at all. Mm -mm. No fear at all. That's why I tell any man, say, listen, you, if, well, I'm single, but when I was in whatever kind of involvement with me, I said, look here, it don't make no sense. You want to run yourself and then come, come back to who? Me not go play no raise no dead. No, sir. That I want miracle, me not go work. Yeah. Yeah, that's real. Real talk. Yeah, man. So, real talk. And them time they know that they, they, your big thing waited out so powerful and run out of street. Shivlock, or it just lenke lenke, some part okay, and then some part not okay. And then women too, you know, well, like 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 we, we, we discovered earlier in the conversation, the myth would have it to say that the more a woman run up and down, the looser she get. But I don't know, because you say you had that experience, Carla. But what I'm saying, though, it's the more your muscle work, you should be able to keep that 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 firmness. You know what I'm that's saying? What I, that's, what I'm, that, that's what I believe. So I guess working the muscle is different from having some big old something with stretch and, you know, I don't yeah. know. So it, it could be a difference. Yeah. I don't know. I'm not the doctor or whatever. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't yeah. know what caused it, but then it happens. It happens. Yeah. It happens. So but yeah. me and I said to all women, take care of themselves. Present yourself good. Mm -hmm. And eat right and you know, exercise and, take care. and stay yeah. hydrated too. Yeah. You and, a lot of water. and pineapple is a real thing, yeah. Yeah, fruits, fruits is healthy. In general, yeah. yeah. But pineapple is really, it's not a joke when you hear them say about the pineapple, a real deal. It, it's it's a, it's a real thing. It's good to, yeah. to eat pineapples, ladies. Uh -huh. And exercise, exercise is important. Sometimes you just go down and you do your, your pelvic. Um, because even if you're someone who who is, you know, um, has given birth, you have to remember to you have to keep your pelvic floor um, worked because remember it, that floor can weaken. That floor can weaken, you know. You understand what I'm saying? This everything is muscles. Yeah. You understand? So I hope you guys are learning because I've learned a lot tonight. Even though we find some of it funny, but a reality. And you know, we're grown yeah. people. We can talk the truth. We can express ourselves so that, like you said, call us somebody else can learn. It's also a learning session. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. So I hope somebody All learns right. something tonight. So was, thank you so much. It was nice talking to you. Yes. Uh -huh. Yes. Thank you so much for your inputs. And, you know, please come back and please share. Let others know. All right. Okay. Thank All you right. so much. Enjoy your holidays. All right, same to you. Okay, thanks. Yes, guys, all my really. So we've come to the end of another session. Saturday Night Live, chatbot, adapt my say, adjust reality. And, you know, be prepared for any topic when you come here on a Saturday Night Live around about 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And if you feel like you have a burning topic that you want us to discuss, reach out to me by, via WhatsApp 239. As you see on your screen, you can either call or text WhatsApp only 239-404-6147. And I would suggest that if you're going to suggest a topic, it's good that you would be on that live so that we can hear more from you. You understand what I'm saying? Because we've had people who they give topics and, you know, they didn't even come on to discuss, but that's okay because we still have other people who can learn from those topics as well. So with that being said, I hope that you are enjoying your holidays. You're staying safe. You're being prudent and not spending off your money. 
And then when come January, you're broke. And you know, January is like an elephant month. So be wise in everything that you do. And just remember that in life, we all have to be well-rounded, full of fire, fortified, and diversified. You understand what I'm saying? Now, if you are real and you want us to chat the real stuff, then always come back. Come back here. Follow me for the juice, the sauce, the secret, the reality, and positive vibes when? On a Saturday night at my royal space. You don't know. It's your girl, Royal Nurse Cleopatra, a.k.a. your number one sensible specialist in the stratosphere who has spiraled from stupidity to sensibility. All right, guys? So enough love, enough respect, and make it your place every Saturday night. Even if you out, you can put on and you listen if you want to call in, and I want you to participate. And please invite others, share and like, and also comment. So. Peace out, peace out. I just reality. Fun Cleopatra, man. Reality, she a deal with us. She not act shy. I just reality. Fun Cleopatra, man. Reality, she a deal with us. She not act shy. What she say? Cleopatra, she there. Uh, be all the boys and girls. Them I want a teacher. Number one sensible specialist in the area. She not follow, follow, cause she done a leader. So you better come true with your best behavior. Hey, behavior. Behavior, she gonna make sure she not late. For each other, just reality. Fun Cleopatra, man. Yeah, I will have more. I will that. Yeah, roll up, roll up on a new chill spot, Saturday Night Live, with your number one sense of a specialist. Shark mouth, and that's it. What you say? Meet her up there, live, with Royal Cleopatra. She'll chat about the whole of things. Yeah, health, wealth, lifestyle. Yeah, man. She ever put you like a sense of humor in it and talk about the Almighty God. Meet her up there, Royal Cape Punch, your Saturday Night Live. Car. Jean, June, and Sharon, they say that them love you. That's what they say. Yeah. Saturday Night Live, Royal Cape Punch, your Saturday Night Live.